evening. Uju, what is good about this evening? I don't understand. What is it? What have I done again this time? Eh? Uju, what is good about this evening? Have you gone out of your mind? I don't understand. What have I done? What is it? What have you not done? You leave this house without giving me attention. To you, I'm now a log of wood. Honey. Yes. Honestly, I don't understand where all this is getting at. Have I for once referred to you as a log of wood? When was the last time you spent time with me? No, tell me. You leave the kids under my custody. To you, I'm now a nanny. Oh, yes. Let me tell you something. This whole thing is affecting my business and I won't take it anymore. As you can see, I am really tired. Please, let's just talk about this. How, how, how dare you walk out on me? I'm still talking to you, Uju, and you're walking out on me. Have you lost your mind? I don't understand. I wasn't done talking to you. And who are you? Who are you? Why do you always nag like a woman? Eh? Is it because, I mean, because I've been keeping quiet? What is your problem? No, tell me. What is your problem? Eh? Out there, other people appreciate me because of how industrious I am. But here you are, you don't even appreciate anything about me. And here you are telling me you, you've not, you're not done talking. What else do you have to say? Ah. Yes! Okay. Please. Okay, now I understand. Okay. Eh. So you prefer other people? No problem. I know what to do. No problem. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, man. Honey. Uh, honey. Uh, Uju, who is she? Oh. I brought us a maid. You know, at least someone that will be helping us with um, some domestic chores. Domestic chores? Yes. Yoga. <laughs> Good afternoon, sir. Uju, are you serious? Uh, I'm serious now. You know, since we have always both busy, it's only better that we, we get someone that will be helping us. Uju, did you consult me before making that decision? Uh, or you're just imposing things on me? Honey, what are you saying? I'm doing this for the betterment of this family, so what, what are you Did saying? Did you consult me? I didn't need to consult you. I know we need a maid, so that's what I did. I don't know why you never accept anything I do in this house. I don't know again, no. No, you, you can't make this... But would you, you can't, you can't bring someone into our house without telling me first. We need someone to... Whoa! What happened to, 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 what happened to your hands? But you know I'm always busy. Please, we are, she just came. Let's not do this. Let's, let's not do this, please. In fact, come, let me show you to your room, please. Let's go, let's go. They vex. You know they vex. They go. They go in. Put them to bed, sir. <coughs> sir, do you want anything, sir? Where's my wife? She's not yet back, sir. What? She's not yet back, sir. She's not back? No, no, sir. 
At this time? Yes, by this time, sir. Please get me water to drink. Oh. Welcome, ma. Plenty wahala in some families today. Sometimes it's from the man or from the woman. Some women they get wahala. They will choose their career over their husband's so, and hand over the home to their housemates and hand over Oga to their housemates. Some housemates they like a better thing, you know. Before you know it, they will take over the home, take over Oga, begin service Oga. Hey, before you know it, it will be too late for madame. Hey. We have different. What do you want to do? Ah, what is all this? I know what to do. Where are you going to now? I know what to do, no problem. Thank you very much. Ah, what is your problem? No, I'm just trying to settle something. What's up? Um, I'll be traveling to Abuja tomorrow for a work trip. It's just two weeks. It's okay. Safe trip. No need travel. <laughs> just like that. Honey, you should be happy for me. Do you know how much they are going to pay me? Five million naira. Listen, stop trying to pull words out of my mouth. I said, have a safe trip when you travel. What have I said? What wrong have I said? I said, have a safe trip when you travel. I wish you good luck. I wish you everything good in life. How am I saying it? You said, honey, I want to travel. I said, no problem. You can travel. Eh? You can stay one month, two months, or three months if you uh. like. I, I won't be bothered. I'll be traveling to Abuja tomorrow, okay? So I need you to take care of the house. You know how Oga hates to see the house when it's dirty. So just try and do whatever you can to make sure it's clean, okay? Madam, I don't want you to talk small, small. No worry. I will do them. I'll take care of everybody. I trust you. <laughs> <laughs> One more thing. Mm. Please, make sure you feed my husband very well. You know how much he likes food. Madam, just leave her. I know your husband's best food. I know what I will prepare for her. He will like her. <laughs> mm. um, one last thing. My children, please be very careful what you do in front of them. Ha. You know how they are. They like to emulate adults, whatever they are doing. Madam, you know, get wahala. Okay. No worry. I will take care of everybody. You know, get problem at all. Thank you. And it will make you come here. Yes. And make sure you also take care of yourself. Ah, madam, me. I don't always take care of myself. I go feed everybody fat before you get come back. I'm my fan, madam. That you too fine. Oh, fine like me. Oh, stop now. But you find like 10 people. It's okay. Thank you. I check All right. This girl, I think I'm lucky to have her. Plenty of housemates like you better than you. Before you know it, okay. they will take over the home. Take over the hey. God. Begin service of God. <laughs> hey, before you know it, it will be too late. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, okay. Hey, okay. 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 Hey. Okay. 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 Okay.
You know what? Mm -hmm. let, me, let me take you. Let me wait, take you. wait. I'm not drunk. Okay. I'm not. Okay. But let, let me take you inside. Yeah? Okay. Hey. Okay. Okay. Small, small, small. Okay. Hey. Okay. 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 Oh, yeah. let, let me take you inside your room. I love you. Ah. You love me. We are. Uh, okay. Yes, we are family. Let's go. 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 Making trouble in your home because of your guilt, hoping I'm magic. You are gradually destroying your home. More. You are gradually disturbing your home. Wait, 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 wait. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> are you sure you can take care of yourself? Yes, I'm fine. I just had a little to drink. Is it a Bible? You must drink to, you know, ease off the stress. Okay, let me go and take care of them. No, come. We have a lot to talk about. Ha! Come, come, come. Okay. Come. Okay. Wait, wait. <laughs> come now. Okay. Okay. Listen, listen to me. Listen, listen. I know I'm drunk, but I'm not usually like this. Eh? But you know, there's something that I wanted to tell you. No, God, don't tell come me. You would have told me this thing in the past. Wait, wait, come, come, come. Oh God, Stay you, with me tonight. This thing you are going to tell me inside the room. You no, have told me. Ah, oh God, you are on the come bed. Come now. Oh God, we will not be happy. Oh wait. God, we will not be happy. Uh, wait, oh listen, God. listen. Oh God. Wait now. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Okay, I'm, I'm strong, sir. Okay. Um, uh, uh, I wanted to tell you something. Eh? Okay. Do, do you know you're a very fine girl? Ah, oh I'm not fine, no. Wait now. Ah. Wait. Um, I, I'm always scared at night. Huh? Huh? Oh. I, I can't sleep alone. Forgot me, I'm scared too. I, no, you don't understand. I want you to stay with me this night. Ah, oh God. Huh? Oh God, stay that with... place your hand is good. It's no not good though. Wait. It's not good though. Listen to me. Why are you screaming? Oh, okay. Calm down. Okay. Listen, uh, come and stay. Come and sit here. Oh no, just think. Okay, you are doing is not good though. Mm. Just don't move. Okay, you are going to go ahead. Wait. Ah, Oga. Oga, this. Oga, Oga, you are carrying me on the bed. Wait, wait. Okay, I'm not shouting. You'll be too late for Madame. We have different kinds of women. Some will love you too much, you go big in fear. Fear. Some will worry you so much, you go one disappear. One disappear. All your actions is based on experience. Experience is the best teacher. Experience is the best teacher. Experience is the best teacher. For my house, man, and now hey. the of the house, so hey. why are Wake you up. so afraid no. to allow any lady in okay. your home? What are you doing here? Are you afraid? God. What are you doing here? How did you get in here? Oh, God, you were the one that said I should, I should come and sleep with you here in the room. You said you used to be scared of sleeping alone at night, and me. Okay. Said you should sleep here. Okay, it was you now. You shifted my part and you entered now. You were the one who said I should sleep on the bed with you. 
Ah. Did you do anything? Ah. Okay, you, 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 you tore my pants though. You tore my pants. I tore your pants? Yes, Oga. Let me see. <laughs> Please leave this room before my, my kids wake up. Oga, now you are chasing me out of the room, but you were the one that forced me inside this room. And you are the are, one are you out of your mind? They begged me to shift my pants. You, you shifted my pants. Now so, you are begging me to, to you are shouting at me. Why are you talking about it? It's I'm, okay. I'm going to tell Madame. I'll tell Madame when Madame comes back. I'll tell Madame. I'll tell her. Um, it's okay now. Come now, let's talk. Eh? Nice, I won't wait, wait, my pants. No, so wait, 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 should, wait, should, wait, should, wait. Should wait. Listen, listen to me, listen to me. Uh, uh, you don't have to tell my wife, okay? I'll take care of you. Listen, how much do you want? I'll, I'll give I you. don't want your money. I don't want your money. And hold on, uh, uh, wait now. Listen, you don't have to tell my wife, okay? I promise to take care of you. you just tell me anything you need. I, 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 I promise I'll, 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 I'll give it to you. But don't tell my wife, please. Okay? Eh? Please now, don't wait. Don't talk to me now. Don't, don't, don't tell my wife. Please. Huh? This is the best teacher. There is too much drama in some homes today. Plenty wahala in some families today. Sometimes it's from the... Oga. Oga, you don't want to use the farm. Huh? You don't want to use the fan, though. Huh? You don't want to use the fan. Um. Uh, the fan is not off. Okay, the AC is off. Yeah, it is. The AC is off. I forgot. Ah. Is there anything you need for me to do that? Are you not going to church today? Okay, I am. Um, I just dressed up the kids. I'm still dressing them up. By the time you are done, we'll leave for church together. Oh, okay, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Are you. Not going to church. Yes. No, 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 no. I don't feel like going today. I just want to stay home and rest. Oh, I need to get some rest. Yeah. You need to. Ah. <laughs> so, 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 Somehow, what goes around no, will come around. Now you are going around, causing trouble, oh, making trouble in your home. Because of your guilt, hoping I'm Maggie. You are gradually destroying your home more. You are gradually disturbing your home. What are you still doing here? Um, I've dropped the kids at the church. 
So I decided to um, to come back home. Ah. But were you not supposed to stay in church after dropping the kids? What are you doing here? What will I be doing in church when you are all alone in the house? Eh? Okay. Um, are you sure about that? Strong for me tonight. Mm. <laughs> yes, Oga. <okay>. Three come. <laughs> I need you to Let be. Let me a... ask you. Hmm? It looks like uh, <laughs> you want some more. Ha! Oh, can I not find you some small, small? Hey, hey. <laughs> Oga, okay. huh? I am ready for you tonight. You are ready. Very ready. How ready are you? Hmm? Oga. Okay. How ready? Oga, okay, you know, see, you see, you see the position when I do. You see the position. <laughs> hey! This man, you be bad man. <laughs> Okay, you two like Martino! I'm thinking we should go out. Let's go somewhere. Good night. Now. Welcome. Welcome. Would you? Um, honey, I wasn't expecting to see you. I thought you said you were going. How are you? Are you still going for the business meeting? Are you done with it? Hmm. I know you can't wait for me to go back. Because I can see you're already enjoying yourself. Would you... How, how do you mean? What are you talking about? What are you doing with Amuli? A common maid. What are you doing with her? Hmm. Would you... I remember telling you that I don't need a maid. I told you because I knew one day you're going to use it against me. Mm. Yes. Hmm. You want to turn it around, right? No, you want to turn it around. Let me even ask you. Why do you always blame me for everything you don't do right? Why? Instead of you to at least try to defend yourself. Mwah. You now turn it around to make it look as if I'm, 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 the, I'm the guilty one here. Why? Why do you do that? Uju, can you stop nagging? Oh, I'm nagging. For once in your life, can you stop nagging? I am nagging. Yes, you are. Other women come back home to share their work experiences with their husband. But what do you do? You come back home to fight. That's all you do. Fight, fight, fight. Can you do something else? Why? Uju, nagging. Yes. You nag a lot, and it's becoming unbearable. Ha! You have fulfilled your mission in my house. So, you can go. I'm pregnant. What? What did you say? I'm 
pregnant. And who is responsible? Moga. Moga is responsible. Tell me. She's. It's not true. What is she saying? Asubika, talk. What is she saying? You caused it. It was your fault. If she's truly pregnant, then you caused it. Listen, you don't let me. You don't give me attention. I told you I don't want a maid. But you never listened. You come back from work, you don't let me touch you. You see me... You, you, you think I'm a log of wood? Is that what you think? Come on now. Listen, I, I don't regret anything that happened. Masubike. Are you really saying all these things to me? Is this how you pay me back? After all I have done for you? I know how much I have put into your business to make sure it's moving. And this is all I get. Listen, I'm not even going to take that. When I married you, I married you as a wife. I didn't marry you as a business partner. Okay? Listen to me. In marriage, there's something called conjugal duties. A husband and his wife must have sex. That's the union they share to make their marriage last longer. But you don't have time for me. I want to touch you. You say no. You come back from work. You take off your clothes. I want to touch you. You say no. You tell me you're tired. Eh? And you, why didn't you tell me you were pregnant? Why did you not tell me you were pregnant? I was afraid. I, I, afraid of what? Are you not supposed to tell me first? I only found out yesterday. You only found out yesterday? Yes. Eh? So, so you, you, you want to put me into trouble? Eh? You want to put me into trouble? What is her? Eh? Are you not supposed to tell me you were pregnant? Okay, I said I just found out. Are you not sitting? I just found out. Come on, shut up. Women, they get to our house. They will choose their career over their husband, so. And hand over the home to their housemates. And hand over Oga to their housemates. Some housemates say like you better than you know. Before you know it, they will take over the home. Take over all God, begin serving all God. Babe, I'm sorry. I, I don't know what came over me. It is the devil's work. S something just entered my body and I just started acting stupid. B but, but... You're sorry, right? Yes. You are sorry. I'm very sorry, baby. What are you sorry about? For everything. I'm, I'm sorry about everything. For you cheating on me? Or you sleeping with my maid? On our matrimonial bed? Or you getting her pregnant? What exactly are you sorry about? Baby, I swear, it's not me. It was the devil that entered my body. The, the, the devil used my body to commit, you know... You don't what? Adultery. Baby, I do. No, you don't. Baby, I do. That is why you always nag about everything I do. But it's fine. Baby, wait. I, Baby. I think I'll leave you. Baby, so please. You can just leave it the leather suit. It hasn't gotten to that, baby. Stop calling me, baby. Stop it. 
Baby, it was the devil that entered my body. Hey, stop it! Hey! Baby, baby. Ba baby, baby, wait now. It's the devil. Can you not touch me? Would you? I I go to leave the kids and I just because of this. Angolika. Angolika. I am leaving this house for you. What? I leave you with these words. It will never be well with you. You will know no peace for doing this to me. Baby, 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 wait. Baby, listen to me. Don't go. I, I apologize for everything. It was a devil. The devil entered my body. Can you not touch no, me? Don't, don't to touch me. me. It's not me. <laughs> baby, please, don't go. Don't, don't, don't leave the kids alive, please. Please. B baby, please. It was the devil that entered my body. It, it, it wasn't, you know I'll never do this to you. I don't know what came over me. The devil entered my body. And I, I, I am going to my children's school. Because I can't leave my children for this beast. She will kill them. Baby. You have always said you don't see me as your wife. I guess you now see my maid as your wife, so... Come on now, don't say that now. You two can continue. Baby, no. Baby, listen to but me. you. You know no peace. Except I got him from another woman. Baby, 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 wait, baby, wait. Succeeded in ruining my family. I'm talking to you! Ha! Okay, what is it now? You want to beat me? Oh, now you are blaming me! No, you want to blame me! You've forgotten the time that you were begging me. Come on, Daddy Duvi. You shift my pants to one side. You were begging me. Open your leg. Now you are blaming me. Or oh, you want me to go outside and tell people how you raped me? Or oh, you want me to tell them how you begged me not to say anything to anybody? But you came back and you seduced me into mm. having sex with you. Oh, well, yes! Uh, small boy! If I tell you to come and suck breast, you come and suck breast. If I tell you to jump into fire, you jump into fire. Don't just, don't, don't do this, oh. Don't do this, else I will just go to the right authorities and report to them that you went through this house. Now listen to me. You better be careful. Don't do more damage. Don't make this more difficult than it is. I should Please. Be. I should not. Don't make this difficult for me to face. But you are the one that led me to it. Your wife was standing here. You are saying devil that entered you. So me, I'm the one that is the devil now. No, I'm the one that is the devil. I'm the devil that entered this You time. chased my wife away. You're happy. Who chased her away? You. Who chased her away? You. Okay, you were the one that was begging me. You were the one begging me, okay? I'm a married man. I am a married man. Uh, but when you were shouting upstairs, oh, bugomo, oh, bugomo, you didn't know you were married. Okay, please just allow me to join this film and watch it now. Let me go and pack my bags and put it inside that room. You, you, you women, you know what you're doing. Ah, uh ah. -uh. Yes, you women, you know what you're doing. Oh God, what did I do now? You women, you know what you're doing. Look at what you're carrying. Ha. Ha have you seen what you're carrying around? Oh God, you have said it now. I know you love me the way I love you. Yes, please. Come on, leave me alone. Would you, would you please, please, listen to me. Would you please, you, listen. You, can you stop? You, you can't remember how we started. You can't, you can't leave me like this. I can't leave you, right? Yes. Why are you embarrassing me on the road? Why are you making it look as if I'm the bad one here? Babe, listen to me. The devil is trying to separate us. Can't you see this? Mm -hmm. Can't you see? <laughs> Azubike, I'm sorry. You cannot deceive me this time. Please, just stay away from I, me. I, 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 oh, I, I, I promise never to make this mistake again. Oh, please. <laughs> Azubike. You were sleeping with her for only God knows how long. You got her pregnant. Azubike, I'm very sure you're still sleeping with her. No, 
Wait, who do you think I am? A fool? <laughs> Azumike, let this be the last time you stop me to, to tell me rubbish. Please. It's obvious we can no longer stay as husband and wife in the same house. So please, just leave me alone. Leave me alone. No Jupiter will make me go back to that house. For him... Would you please? Mama, for him to sleep with my maid on my matrimonial home and even got her pregnant. Do, do you even know what that means? It's a slap on my face. It's over between us. Don't make your decision that rigid because you don't know how deep the future can be. <laughs> Please. Mama, no matter how deep that future is, I am not ready to be in it with someone this careless and, uh, and callous. I've been enduring him all this while, but not anymore. Not anymore. I actually thought he's my class, but no. I stood so low as to, as to marry him. What did I get? What? He did not even see anything good in me. Mama, please. Thank God he has found his match. So let him, let him just go. Let him go. I can feel the bitterness in your heart. Please, calm down. I can feel the bitterness in your heart, my dear. But just pray you don't wake up to life when there's no longer anything to fix up, please. I don't at all encourage cheating, you know that. But divorce cannot bring you joy, my daughter. Please, I beg of you. It's my sanity we are talking about here. And I know you're talking like this because it's your son. But I I'm sorry. I you. can't live with a cheating man. I can't. Obianuju. You know I love you so much. Ever since you were married into this family, I've always taken and seen you as my own blood daughter. I can tell you nothing but the truth. Divorce cannot bring you joy. I don't support it at all. I only support it when it becomes a threat to life in any marriage. But it cannot bring you happiness. So please, I beg of you, reconsider. Oh, please. Oh, Mama. Mama. I have made up my mind. And... I can't go back on that decision. I'm, I'm sorry. Mama, it's enough. You have done well. The Uju I know can be very difficult when it comes to her decisions. Thank God you already know that. However, it's okay. Let her go. But I want my kids. I paid your bride price, so I have every right to take my kids. Mm -hmm. Yes. And I'm also telling you, I cannot leave my children in the hands of a foolish man like you. I'm giving you until weekend. Or to be kind enough, let me just say, next weekend, to bring my kids. Else, you would see that foolish man in me. Do your worst. Do your worst. Mama, be outside. Mama, be in the car. Going to? I am going to my father's house. I have a home. And I have a family. And what about my child? It's my body and can handle it. <sighs> the 
Listen, I understand how you feel. But well, please, don't go. I, I don't want to stay alone. I'll be lonely if you leave me. For the sake of the child, just stay. Please. Please. Huh? What if Madame comes back? Eh, don't worry about that. I, I can handle it. We have to take your, your things back to the room. Listen, can I come and see your people? Huh? Talk to me now. Can I come and see your people? I'll think about it. Did you say I should go to you? Yes, let me help you. Let's go back to my room. So it will now become our room. Don't you like that? Carry the bag. Please carry it, Mosmo. Let me go and pack your other ones. Sounded really bad. What happened? Emeka, I can't take this anymore. I can't. Calm what nonsense is this? Just calm down. What has she done this time around? And who's this now? I've told you. Hello? What? Where is she now? Please, I'm here to see my wife. So who is the wife? She was she was brought here today. Just calm down, calm down, calm down. She was brought here today. No, okay. What are you there already? Good day, sir. Good day. I I'm here to see my wife, please. Your wife? Yes. Is that your wife? Yes, doctor, that's my wife. I left her this morning very healthy and strong. What happened? Mr. Zubik, are you having any issues with your wife? No. No, my wife and I are very peaceful people. Your wife is unconscious due to stress and inadequate sleep. So she needs a lot of rest. Well, doctor, I'm very sorry to hear this, but if that's the only thing wrong with my wife, then I should be on my way back to the office. My wife has vehemently refused to rest. And if anything happens to her, God knows I have tried my best. It's okay. Please meet the reception for the payments. What is wrong with your wife? Mecca, please, I need a favor from you. If it's something I can do, why? I will. All right, that's fine. I need a nanny. A nanny who's good at doing house chores. Okay, there's no problem. When do you need her? But I need the person, like, like right now, like straight away. All right, consider it done. All right. But what is wrong with your wife? 
Emeka, listen. You haven't told me anything about This is not the time for that. I promise to tell you everything. But right now, get me a nanny, please. And don't forget, she must be good at house chores. Okay. Huh? I will do that immediately. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. Thank you. Mm. What's, what am I doing here? Well, you fainted on the road and some people brought you here. Fainted? Yes. Why? My, my baby. Oh. I have my baby on my back. Yes, Where? yes. Uh, your baby is with the nurse. They are feeding her. Okay? Can I, can I, can I have my baby, please? Okay, I'll get her right away. Right, I'll be right back. Where's my husband? Hi. What's up? You guys okay? No. What's wrong? You haven't eaten all day. You haven't eaten all day? Yes. Are you joking or something? I'm not joking. Dad, where's mom? Huh? Alright, let's go in. I'll, I'll make something for you guys. Mom will soon be back, okay? What about mom? She'll soon be back. She'll soon be back? Yes. But she was here this morning. Be careful so you don't fall. Listen. Stay well. Let's go. What, what, what would you like to eat? Oh, go inside! So be my mom. <laughs> so that's all. Correct, my right? That's everything. Yeah, this is the nanny you asked for. Oh, okay. What's your name? My name is Ruth. What? Ruth. Ruth. I hope you know what you're here for. Yes. I was told I'm coming here for a nanny job. I want to believe you can do the job because I don't entertain laziness. Sure, sir. Just give me one week. If I don't do well, you can sack me. But I'm sure I'll, I'll serve you very well, sir. That's fine. We'll give it a try. All right, bro. I have to be on my way now. I have appointment to catch. I'll see you. All right. All right. Sorry. Let's try. Please don't disappoint me. You know this girl very well. Well, I don't know her, but I know her, madam. She brings them from the village, teaches them how to cook and do other housework, then give them out as none. I just wanted to be sure. You know, times are bad. I just hope your wife will like her. Listen, this house belongs to me. I am not going to take that rubbish from her this time. Don't make trouble. I wouldn't want to hear that you're having an issue with her. Please. But she's taking more than required. And I honestly don't think I can continue with her like this. Do you know she's been starving my children all day? Hey, calm down, calm down, calm down. That, is, that could be as a result of what happened. I know your wife very well. She doesn't joke with her kids. No. It's what you're seeing from the outside. I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you know better than I do 
All I want to tell you is that handle your home peacefully. If not for anything, at least for the sake of your kids. I have to be on my way now. Yep. Who is she? Her name is Ruth. She's your new nanny. She'll be taking care of you. But what about mom? Wait, wait, let me get this straight. You hired a nanny? If you hired her, then where's mom? Mom is... Mom will, will be with you shortly. I'm actually going to pick her up. Before you said she is, you pick her up. Now you're still saying it again. And again. You don't trust me? Alright, trust me. Have you said hello to her? Have you said hello to her? Hello. hello. No. That's how you say hi to someone? Hello. And you take off your face? Hello. Hi. Hi. Alright, trust me. I'm going to pick Mama. Alright? Okay. You sure, Dad? You don't trust me? Show her to the guest room. I'm going to pick mom up. Oh, all right. Guest room? Yeah. What about her room? Guest room. Show her to the guest room. Guest room. Fine, let's take you to your guest room. You gotta take your bag. Don't take it for us. Let's have to see you. You called me, sir. Uh, What's funny? Uh, what? Funny? What? Mom, I'm funny. No, I'm not funny. You. I'm not laughing. Hey, uh, hey, Now listen. There, there's a new nanny. I want you to watch her. Put an eye on her. Oh God, nanny! Nanny! Hey, what? What is it? Uh, 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 nothing. It's just that at this junction, I was shocked hearing that. Listen, I don't have time for your foolishness. And whenever you're talking to me, put your put your voice down. This is not Onicha. You are not in Onicha for crying out loud. Open the gate. Open the gate. I don't want them. Open the gate.
I don't know what to say. Um, but it better stop her from anything that is making her go through stress. That is, if you still want her to be alive. Doctor, with due respect, I think you should speak to her yourself. That doesn't sound normal. You are her husband. Better do that yourself. Doctor, I've tried. I've tried to talk to her, but... She's refused to listen. So, I, 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 I suggest you, you talk to her yourself, please. I have spoken with her. Okay? Please, take her home. Thank you. Since you fed my children with food, doesn't purge them. And please, when next I'm not around, you see that your nanny, chef, gardener, driver, sack yourself. Don't give my children anything on my behalf again. Oh, because... Madam, Madam, let's go. Oh, Baby. my nanny! How are you? Fine. You missed mommy? Yeah. Oh, mommy missed you guys as well. I, I just kept praying to Madam. come back almost immediately. Madam. Are you, are you stupid or you're just trying to be stupid? What's it? Yes, good day. Oh. Who are you and um, what are you doing in my house? My name is Ruth. I'm, I'm the new nanny. Yeah, the new nanny. New what? The new nanny. 
Asobikiri, what is going on here? Relax, I wanted to explain Mama, to you. Don't tell me to calm down. Asobikiri, be calm. Don't tell me to calm down. Nanny, what? Asobikiri, did I tell you that I want a nanny? Eh? Listen, you need to calm down and hey. let me explain. Okay. I, I wanted to tell you I got a nanny. I mean, if I had told you before asking her to come, I know you wouldn't let that happen. And now that you have told me, you think I will still let it happen? I saw it to not happen. This woman cannot stay here. For what? Eh? Hey, eh, shut up! But surely, was I talking to you? Was I talking to you? Who invited you to this conversation? Oh, they've not even employed you. You said putting money on the husband and wife matter. What hey, is hey. wrong with you? I saw This woman will not stay here. See, before I close my eyes, go inside there, pack your things and leave this now house. Now that's impossible. Anguli, I said that is impossible. She's not going anywhere. Ha. In fact, go, go to your room. Ha. See, see, go see, to your room. See, if I if I slap you, you will turn around like Baba Chia. You want to go upstairs, Asubike? Please, oh, please, don't even try it. You are looking for my trouble now. I have been so quiet. You are looking for my trouble. Oh, you are talking. You are going upstairs. Look at the person you want to come and be me. Anguli, you guys have bumbo. They're not even bloody. You carry one step and jump call to my house. It will not work. Amuli. It will not work. Can, can you be civil? Ah, civil. Yes. Yeah. Can military. you be civil? As a BK, I am military. This woman will not stay here. It is not possible. I said that lady will not stay here. It is not possible. Where is she? Look at the person you want to come and stay in the house. I said, babe, can you tell me what? Say I'm being bumped. Oh, that is what you saw. That is why you brought her to this house. It is not possible. She is very good. You know that you like me. Be careful. Asabike, what wrong have I done to you? I am just coming from the hospital. Why have you decided to welcome me with this kind of problem? Why? Angoli, you collapsed in public. You literally passed out due to stress. I employed someone who is going to help take away your stress and you call that a problem? Yes, it's a big problem. And don't you think you are stressing me the more? I have told you severally, I don't want a maid. I don't want one. Why do you keep, keep trying to make me act like a mad person all the time? So you want to stress yourself to death so that people would say, I have used you for money ritual. That's impossible. I can't do that. Asubike, I don't want that woman in my house. I have been living in this house with you. I have done everything you asked me to do. I, I run errands, I do everything. This is the way I've been living with you. What has changed? Amelie, I have told you time and time again to stop stressing yourself. Now the kids are much. If you don't get a nanny, you're going to stress yourself to death. What's going to happen then? Very well. If you ask me to reduce the number of chores I do in a day, I will. But living with that maid in this house, I won't. She has to go. I don't want her. She has to go. This is my house. And for the last time, she's not going anywhere. Anywhere around you. No, I didn't. Whoever sent you. 
tell them you did not succeed. Uh -huh. If you okay. get, you did not succeed in succeed, or now you have a book. Did you have a man? Show on you. Now who brought you here? Oh, you got a It's 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 Mr. Emeka. He said he's, he's the man's cousin. Oh, I, one. I, I, um... I, I even said no, but they kept on convincing me to believe that I would like it here. Hey, yeah. Oh, uh, one. Um, sorry. No. Sorry, oh. Uh, uh, maybe next time you will learn your lessons. Okay, for you. Sorry, please. What's wrong have I done? Uh, well, you don't know what you have done. Oh, mm. uh, one. Um, now, let me tell you. I just don't shot. Okay, for just shot. I'm a real director. When next you want to call and seek for employment as a nanny to work in somebody's house, you find out from the owner of the house. That means the madam. Find out whether your services is needed or not. Okay, forget. Look at you. I don't even blame you. You pull up a week. We're not be able. We need to be made. Please open the gate for me, Jerry. I also want to do the maid too. Okay, forget. Uh huh. So that madam will increase my salary. I'm going for you there. What are you doing there? Open the gates for me. My friend, move. Jobe, Jobe. Oh. Nene, help her, man. With all these things, uh, 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 your backside. I'm leaving. No, I don't, I don't. Oh, I knew it. <laughs> hey. 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 Anguli, <laughs> I went to her room and she's not there. Well, that is because I don't remember inviting anybody into my home. Have you lost your mind? How dare you send away someone I employ? I should be asking you, Azubike. I should be asking you. Why would you bring a woman into this house after I told you that I don't need a maid? Let me ask a question. Why are you particular about this girl? Is there something you are not telling me? There's something wrong with you. You have gone crazy. Really? Yes. Oh, I have gone crazy. You are the one who likes to fight. You want to argue. When I say something, you want to do otherwise. But you know what? I am not even in the mood. I am not going to have this with you today. Where is she? Where is who? The woman you brought. Nanya Eba. See her here. She is here. Of course she has come back to where she came from. Angoli, for the last time, this house belongs to me. And I want a maid. And there is nothing you can do about that. Then you will have to take me back to my father's house as we can. Take me back to my father's house. What is it? I have said I don't need a maid. What else do you want me to say? I do everything in this house. I, I, I wash your clothes. I sweep the house. I even go as far as washing your car. What do you need a maid for? I'm asking, what do you need a maid for? There is no maid coming into this house and that is fine now. What's wrong with your boss? Why is he looking so furious? Mm. At this junction, 
I am the wrongest person you will be asking that question. You forgive me. And how do you mean? Don't you live in this house? I can only talk about what happened in this gate. Uh, but if you want to know the story what read my father into marrying my mother and they gave it to a very handsome man like me. Okay, forget. If you follow, no, no. Am I not a handsome man? Hey, hey, then we can now go inside. I will tell you all the stories. Bobo. Huh? Eh? You can never change. Yes. Anyway, sorry for wasting my time. I shouldn't be asking you. Excuse me. At this junction, Bobo, people like this will make you lose your job. So keep your mouth shut. I can no no pim 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 pim. Why is your face like this? You came back today. You're supposed to be resting. Why are you looking stressed? Do you know my husband had the guts to bring in a maid into this house after everything I said? Are you serious? That's good news. Oh, close your mouth. <laughs> What is, what is good about what I just said? No, why are you happy? Ah, oh, I should be happy for you. At least now you will get time to rest and enjoy yourself Why the maid will clean everywhere. That will be <laughs> over my dead body. No woman will come into this house as a maid as long as I am alive. I am not taking any maid into my home. I have said that before. Wait, wait, wait. Are you okay? Are you okay? What's your problem? Like, like, what's your problem? I don't have a problem. Amelie, come on. Come on. Your husband wants the best for you. And that's the best he can do to bring someone to help you. Is it what he wants? I want the best for myself. You know, you all don't trust. You don't understand me. You don't understand my pain and my fear. You don't. This pain and fear you always talk about, don't allow it to lead you to early grave. Mm. Eh? What is your problem? Leave it. Let it lead me to my grave. Is it? Is it Shebi, I'm the one that will die. We they bury the two of us together. God forbid. You all have been advising me this past years, and I said I am okay. I don't want a maid. I do everything myself. Why do I need a woman in this house? I don't need anybody. I'm really. I'm your friend, and you know I mean the best. Biko, 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 Chingwe, Ejun Chukunwe Yogi. I am begging you. Just let me be. I am enjoying my life to the fullest. Have I ever come to your house to come and beg you to walk for me in my house? You come here and you have a drink. I take the glasses to the kitchen myself. I do everything in my house. I don't need anybody. I don't need a maid. How many times am I supposed to say it? So what is your problem? You all should just allow me a moment of peace. Please, I don't want a maid. And that is fine now. And you, you need to leave before my husband comes, comes down here and see you. Eh, Biko, you, you've tried now, eh? When you visit somebody, when you stay small, you go home. You don't have to stay till the end of the day. I'm only, eh? Uh, you know, I, I kind of envy you on the alcohol, you know? Really? Oh, yes. <laughs> Well, you can join me if you can. Uh, no, come on. You know I'm on medication. Man. So what do you call the one you're doing now? This is water therapy. Water therapy. I mean water therapy. <laughs> <laughs> Justin, you will kill me. Babe, Ben. Look at that cheek over there. Wow. That girl is cool. She's not cool. She's... Man, you've got eyes for good things, man. Oh, come on. That girl's hot. That girl's hot. You know, I need, I need to talk to that girl. You say what? I said, I need to talk to this Not girl. again. Justin, not again. Take a chill pill. Take a chill pill for what, man? You know I'm a baller. Don't be up on the hill. <laughs> you know I'm a baller and a baller keeps balling. What did he say? <laughs> a baller keeps balling You're all the time. You're a baller and a baller keeps balling all the time, man. You will never change. Still the same. I remember saying that because if I change, them girls are gonna miss me. You, know? you say what? Them if you change, are, them girls are gonna miss me. How <laughs> <laughs> the players rule, man. <laughs> Justin, calm down. Take a chill pill. 
It's going to get you pills. I feel you. <laughs> oh, God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For real. <laughs> Watch your back. I think you need to report this matter to happen. I don't think it is right to get family involved. Besides, their unnecessary opinions might jeopardize the safety of our marriage, and I don't want that to happen. But you can't keep on watching her doing this. It is telling on her. Huh? And if you don't do anything about this, you will end up getting the blame if things go wrong. What could be? But I still don't think it is appropriate to involve her family. That's what I think. Then let her be. Besides, she's not doing anything negative. Do you know what I had to go through because of stress? Perform your conjugal duties on her. Since that is what she wants. Uh -uh. After all the work I did in the house today, you still want to, want to stress me tonight. I'm sleeping with the visitor's room. This girl does all the house chores. She works from morning till night. Huh? She goes to the market, comes back, begins to work. Like, I don't understand. Who does that? You just have to take things easy. She's your wife. Listen, I, I've been silent about it, but, but it's getting worse by the day. So what do you want to do now? I I I I I know I know what to do. I'll I'll find I'll find I'll find a way.
You, 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 you're still awake? Yes, I was waiting for you. <laughs> Sorry for keeping you waiting. It's okay. I know you're tired. Let me just go and make you something to eat while you come and freshen up. Okay? Let me have it. Okay. Welcome. How was work today? Um, oh, uh, fine. So, how about the clients that were supposed to come in from Ghana? Did you eventually meet them? Oh, yes. <laughs> yes, they. I did. Oh. The meeting went well. Honey, uh -uh. look at your face. You have makeup everywhere. Mm -hmm. eh? You should have cleaned everything up. No, don't worry. I'll help you with that. Yes, look at your shirt. Yes. Eh? You couldn't even button your shirt well. Um, it's, I, uh, it's okay. I've got you. Hmm? Next time, clean up. If not, people will laugh at you. See your face. No, it's, it's, it's... Shh. It's nothing. Okay? I wasn't even saying it for you to explain anything. Because I already know what it is. But it's fine. Come. Shh. Feel free, feel free. Oh, Only that's that's um. No, oh, it's it's. It's okay. I know what it is. Is it not condom? Look at it now. It's condom. No more condom. It's not a big deal. Baby, don't disturb yourself. I can, Just. I, can I don't need any explanation. I, is it not condom? People buy condom anywhere, everywhere. I mean. They use it, I mean, don't worry, sit down. Is that why you're sweating like this? Relax. See, next time clean your face. You have powder all over your face. Baby, it's nothing. Hmm? See, I made you something very special because I know you're hungry. Okay? So let me just go and set the dinner table. Then I'll, I'll come back and get you. It's okay, baby. It's nothing. It's nothing. Trust me, it's nothing. I'll be back.
Yes. Dinner is ready. I, I forgot to tell you. What? I actually ate at the office before coming. Oh no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. I am not buying that. Please. I made something very special for you. Okay? I'm, I'm feel, I'm filled up. Filled up? What did you eat? Just relax. I want you to remove this so that when you're eating, you relax and eat your food. Come here. Let me help you. Let me help you. Let me help you. Mm? <laughs> I made something very nice. You will love it. I know you're hungry because you've been working so hard at the office. <laughs> Come here. Shh. I don't want you to say anything again. Just shh. follow me. Why are you sweating? You don't need to sweat. You're home. It's, it's okay. Come with me. Come. Celebrating. We are celebrating our love. Is love not beautiful? Huh. Or is it not worth celebrating? Honey, honey, I, I, I can't believe my eyes. Uh, don't, don't you like it? Why are you doing this? Oh, baby. Um, please tell me why. Because you're the bone of my bones. <sighs> and the flesh of my flesh. I am your crown. The one that was made to complete you. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm sorry. Please, please forgive me. Sorry for. Forgive me, please. It's okay. It's nothing. I would forgive you for what? You know what? Just come. Come and have a seat. This your love is too big for me tonight. It can kill me. <laughs> How can I kill the only man that I love? Hmm? Baby, if I have to keep saying it, I will say it over and over again. I love you. And I'm ready to spend the rest of my life loving you. Please, just, just eat. Why are you behaving like this? Take Thank you. 
please, uh, please, please. Whatever I've done to you, please forgive me. Please. Please, nothing. Please. You haven't done anything. Come on, sit down. Please. You haven't done anything. You haven't. Or do you think you have done something? To me, you haven't. Just sit down. Sit. Let me just read you. You know, you're my baby. Here we go. Time it is. Oh, speak it, please. I'm, up, I'm almost done. Eh? Please, just go upstairs. I'll meet you up in I should go upstairs. You'd meet me. What What exactly are you doing here by this time? I'm so weak here. I need to get this done. I have a lot to do in the shop tomorrow. If I don't do it now, I can't do it in the morning. Please, let me just, let you know, me just finish. You know what? Just go upstairs. I'll soon be done. I'll join you upstairs. I'm only. I said go upstairs right now. Don't get me mad. Just go upstairs right now. What, what are you doing? Okay. What, what, what's, what's wrong with you? Look at the time. I just wanted to finish the sitting room. I still have the kitchen to clean. At least let me do this so that it will be easier for you. At this time of the night. Anguli, at this time of the night. It's okay. Are you, what's wrong with you? Asubike, it's okay. Please. There's no person here to help me. I have to do this all by myself. Please go upstairs. Go to, go to the room. Let me wash my There's hand a bathroom out. upstairs. Asubike, let me use the one in the kitchen. Okay, I'm waiting for you. Sleeping. Oh, 
go back to sleep again. About to sleep? Yes. What is keeping you awake? What is the problem? Come to my bosom. Come, come. <laughs> Lie on my bosom so you can sleep like a baby, okay? Come. Let nothing disturb you, alright? <laughs> I'm here now. Just sleep. Mommy's here. Okay? Relax, my baby. I love you so much. Just relax. I've really missed you. Same here. <laughs> oh my god. Isabella, hmm? so you've not stopped smoking? <laughs> smoking is not for girls. Oh, come on, Lucy. Stop that sermon. Do you know the vibes I get when I take these sticks? <laughs> my dear, you need to handle this. You'll like it. Lucy, I am away from my father who tells me, Isabella, Isabella, stop smoking, stop smoking. Can you give me peace? I just got in. Talking about your father, your father complained to me that you are becoming too troublesome. Babe, you're a woman. You should be thinking of how to call down on some certain things. You see, that's not why I'm here. I'm here to have peace. Can I just have the peace? I feel it. Impossible. Yeah, impossible. Okay. Thank you. My father reported to you that I'm smoking, right? Did he also tell you that he froze my account? Oh, yes, he did. He froze my account. I don't even have access to a dime. So how do I buy anything? Well, he's your father. I think he knows what's best for you. Okay, he is my father. He is not my maker. My maker knows what's best for me, not my father. Can we stop this sign on, please? I need vodka, vodka, correct room. Anyways, you're welcome to my house. I mean, it's equally your house. <laughs> you know what? Um, let me take the bag inside. Okay. No problem. Let's quickly get you something to drink. Asubike, what is the meaning of this? Why did you lock up my shop with another key? That shop was open with my money. I decide what happens to it. Really? Asubike, you gave me 100,000 Naira to start up that business. And now that business is worth over 7 million Naira and you are just locking it up because you want to punish me. Why? Listen, I'm not punishing you. I'm doing what's best for my family. And remember that as your wife, I am a member of that family. What you're doing is against my interest. Angulika, you, you're, you're always very disobedient. You know that. <laughs> you know, I know exactly why you are doing this. But may I remind you that I was a maid. I worked my ass out as a maid. I had a passion for it. Nobody forced me into it. I hope you know that. You have to change because you're now my wife. You want me to change? You know exactly why you are doing this. You want me to accept you bringing a maid into the house, right? <laughs> That's fine. It's okay. But let me make this clear. That will only be possible when I go back to my father's house. Over my dead body will I have a maid in that house. All right, we shall see. We have different kinds of women. Oh yes. Some will love you too much, you go big in fear. 
What's the meaning of the message you sent to me last night? You give me sleepless night, you know. Ben, Ben, I've never been scared my whole entire life as I did last night. You've never been scared? I mean, what sort of fear would make you send that kind of a message that if you don't make it till morning, your wife is responsible? Did she do anything wrong? You don't understand. My wife made a special dinner for me last night. It was so colorful. Colorful that than what I've ever had. Justin, there is no synergy between what you told me now and the message you sent. What do you say now? Come on. Listen, this was more like what Jesus ate before he died at the Last Supper. I mean, why do you think, why do you ever think your wife would want to kill you? They would join you, cannot hurt a fly. Yes. You remember the lady I was with last night? This is my problem with you. This is my problem with you. What has that lady got to do with the message you sent to me? How? What? Listen, a lot. A lot, man. When I got home, I didn't clean up. My wife saw her lipstick stain on my lips. And a pack of condom fell from my pocket. And she just put it up as if it was nothing. And she went ahead to prepare this delicious dinner for me. But how would you make that kind of mistake for God's sake? What was the pack of condoms in your pocket? What were your intentions? I don't know. I don't know if you ask me, man. I don't know. Just I think my village people are after me. They just want to poison our mind towards me. Nobody's after you. Justin, your wife is the best woman in the world. Believe me. I mean, she just wants the best for you. That's all. No. No, no, man. I see that as the last one in. In fact, I'm, I'm beginning to get scared of that woman. And don't ever send that kind of message to me again. Don't. Are you, are you saying this to me? I, I, I came to you so you can help me think. And look at what you're telling me. I am telling you what I think about the whole stuff. Please. Don't send any message to me that will raise my blood pressure. I want to leave. What you ah. want to leave? Where's your life going? Where, where's your life going to? What you mean to help me think? Do you help know what that think, message did to, did to me? I did not sleep. You want to raise my blood pressure? I'm going to calm down now. Who's raising your blood pressure? I'm the one in this situation and you're telling me I want to raise your blood pressure? Then you know why. Take it easy. Take a chill pill. Look at this. There is a woman that uses a traditional medicine to heal addiction. A lot of people have been attesting to the efficacy of her medicine. Babe, I think you need this. Well, you clearly do not know what I need. Obviously. Babes, you need to stop this. Look, I've been looking for a possible way to help you get rid of this addiction. Your father personally called me the last time and he sounded so bitter about you. I don't know why you're talking too much. Lucy, why are you doing this? I've told you to take my father out of my life. Don't even talk about him. I came here to have fun. Can you let me live my life the way I want to? Like, is it possible? Look, there is no amount of joy you cannot get living with your father. I mean, that man is ready to provide anything for you. But he chose not to. I cannot force him. He chose not to. I cannot live the life he wants me to live. Don't you understand? Uh, Lucy, I am here for peace. I'm here to have fun and to just relax my nerves. Can you let me? Because if you bring this topic again, it just means, Isabella, it's time for you to go. And I'll gladly pack my things and leave. Oh, no. I mean, it has not gotten to that. I, I am only trying to help. You don't have to reach that matter now. Don't they even pass.
<laughs> My friend, I know you're not going to believe what I saw yesterday. What is it? I will tell you. Go on. I saw your shameless husband kissing a girl in public. Is that it? I mean, is that what you said I will not believe? Isn't that incredible enough? If it's that one, I mean, I saw him too. And you did nothing about it? Cynthia, what did you expect me to do? I should flog him or I should punish no, him? You, you surprise me right now. Are you the one saying this? Even the Bible says if you catch your spouse cheating on you, pack your bags and leave. Aww. <laughs> Cynthia. So you are invariably saying I should be on my way home now, right? <sighs> That's not what yes. I mean. What do you mean? What? I mean, confront your husband. Ask him why is he cheating on you? Oh, really? Okay, now I am going to ask you. Will his explanation bring any sort of relief to me? Answer me, what is that going to do for me? Wait, are you trying to justify his act right now that him cheating on you is okay by you? Cynthia, don't get me wrong. It's not okay by me. But, I mean, what am I going to do? Eh? I will only try to change him. Yes. <laughs> change? Ah, oh, you lie. Change? Oh. A cheating husband? My darling, no, it's not possible. You know that. You can never ever change a cheating husband. My darling, if I catch my husband this close to a woman, talkless of kissing, you will not like what I will do to him. It's either I'll kill him or I pack my bags and leave. Seriously, I can't. I can't stand it. What's funny? <laughs> You go begin fear. Huh. Some will worry you so much you go and disappear. Oh, wow. All their actions is based on experience. Experience is the best teacher. Ooh. Experience is the best teacher. There is too much drama in some homes today. Plenty wahala in some families today. Sometimes cry? it's from the man. Or from the woman Some women may get They will choose their I'm not crying, it's just that um I'm not too happy. Uh, Mom who offended you? Nobody. Nobody? Um yes. Nobody, Calvin. I am. Um, everything will be all right. Seriously, Mom. Yes. Mom, can we stay with you? I would really love that, but I. I need to make some business calls, so. Um, I want you two to go upstairs, Calvin. Mm -hmm. Take your sister upstairs and make sure you get your assignment done. Okay. Um, but Mom, I'm true with my assignments done with everything but mom please can we just you know go outside play with the gate man please okay that's fine yes you guys can um meet the gate man it's fine yeah mm. all right run along okay. all right come on sis let's go are you not forgetting something oh Me. I don't stay out too long. Like okay. better oh, thing. Before you know it, they will take over the home. 
Take over, oh God. Begin serving, oh God. Hey, before you know it will be too late for Madame. Kelvin and Kus, why are you children sitting like a little bed that has been abandoned by the mother? Our mother is not happy. At this don't shock. Everybody is not happy in this country. Okay, forget. Eh, eh, Dalu, I want my mother to be happy. Look, don't ever try to say that again. Do you get me? Oh, one them. Oh, my one chat chat. What did you get me? What's the word, Lord? Even me, but now your mother wants to gain your entire world. Okay, forget. Yes. Now let me teach you, children. A big lesson you need to learn, probably when you grow up. Okay, forget. Now, do not always try to win all the time. The moment you fail, prepares you for a bigger win. Okay, forget. Eh, eh, Daru. Eh, Master, that made your school. What did you get when? I should not be angry when I lose. That's okay. Oh, wonderful. You, you have every reason to be angry. Hey, but don't be too much angry. Don't be angry too much. Okay, forget. Uh -huh. So that you do not forget the lesson you need to learn for your loss. That's why your mother is being so careful. If you forget, she's so careful. And that is why she has been unhappy all this while. Uh -huh. Alright, fine. Shift well. Yeah. But I think it's my right to be angry. I'm angry right now. You know what? I think we should go and play. Share with me. If I tell you something, you won't believe it. What is it? Tell me now what? I met this guy. Hey! My sister, the kind knocking, why I knock today? <coughs> I never knock another in my life. Sweet me die. <coughs> Isabella, like, remind me what you said you came here to do. I came to have fun and to relax, and I'm having every single thing that I want. What did you want? Look, you have to stop this, okay? I mean, you, you get yourself into trouble. You just have to stop this before you, you hurt yourself. Get yourself a decent job and add meaning to your life. Okay, now this is beginning to sound like my father. Like this is my father speaking through a female voice. I don't understand. Is that why I'm here? I came here to rest. Yes, and I need it. Please. I understand. But look, people like you with such opportunities, they live like queens. I mean, you have all it takes to build your own empire and rule your world. Okay, Oshie. Okay. Motivational speaker, but you didn't tell me you have become one. Look, babe, I'm saying the truth. The only thing it will cost you is just loyalty and respect to your father. Okay, I think this conversation oh. is beginning to bore me. I won't even spoil my day. You can't even spoil my day either. Excuse me. Azubike, please, I beg you in the name of God, just give her her keys, the keys to her shop, eh? Take a look at her, can't you see how emotional she has become since you took the keys from her? Please, I beg you. Chinwen, you don't understand. I have pleaded with Angoli to invite her sister over. She needs to help out at the shop. Anguli needs to focus on her family, most especially her child, our child. 
Samuel, but he's making a point. There is sense in what he's saying. What do you think about it? <clears throat> you know exactly why you are doing this. I know why you are doing this. But let me tell you as a king. But if you carry out this evil plot, I swear to you, I will kill myself. I would not be alive to see it happen. Only. Azubiki. What is she talking about? Listen, it, it's personal. Okay? I promise to handle things. However, thanks for your concern. I really, really appreciate it. Please. You have to do everything for my friend to be happy. I beg you. <sighs> I'm only. Treat me like this. Don't I look good enough for you? Oga, why don't you just leave me alone? Why, why can't you just let me be? Let you be? Come on, see, it's been a few years now that I've been chasing you like I'm chasing my dreams. Just say yes to me and I'll treat you as a queen that you are. Wait, do you want me to be your second wife? Oh, no, no, see, I want you to be my girl, okay? And I'll take very good care of you. Do you know how shameless you sound right now? No, 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 no. You must think that I'm an imbecile. That a grown-up girl like me would decide to date someone I know that would never marry me. Oga, please, go back to your wife. Just, just, just go back to your wife. I mean, obviously, she doesn't even deserve someone like you. Uh, listen, see, my friends calls me Justin, the money man. Look, uh, just hold on. You can have us. Come on, take it. For me? Oh, come on, it's nothing and there's much more from where that came from. Wow. Thank you. Ah, nah, come on, you don't need to thank me. There's much more from where that came from. So, are we getting down? You want to get down with me? Of course. Who doesn't want to get down with such? A gorgeous like here. Okay, so tell me when and where. Oh, good then. Um, let's meet at the uh, Red Hot Hotel tomorrow and um, let's get it right and hot. Okay, in that case, let me have your number and then I'll call you when I get there. Oh, God. Uh, get. Yes, um, okay. Um, that's um, 080. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Got it. Huh? I got you. I'll be expecting your call. I'll call you. Why is your face like this? He's not one stupid man like that. I remember the guy, they know a good bit him. Ah, ah, calm down now. You've not even asked me what he did. Okay, sorry. What did he do so that we will know the level of punishment we give to him now? 
Honestly, that man needs to be dealt with. But I don't need a physical confrontation. But babe, I wonder why some married men won't just let some women be. Like, can you imagine the money this man was supposed to give to his wife? He's busy lavishing it on other women. Okay. I don't understand. Now that will make you the vet now, because I don't even understand. The money he's supposed to give to his wife, he's giving it to other women. Uh huh. Wait, babe, don't tell me you like men who behave like that. I'm, I'm just asking, how is your business? Like, oh. <laughs> sweetheart, collect some. What are they give? Take control, palm. As long as you are happy, eat it. Yeah? Hey. Oh, babe, they shock me. Oh. I don't understand. Are they shocking? You don't understand. If that's how you see me, there's no problem. <laughs> For me. Kai, babe, you don't understand. I was. <sighs> anyway. That's why you're angry. Is it not enough reason for me to be angry? My sister, rest, I rest, rest. Ah. Me, I define, I told me as I did, like, I define who gave me money. They tell me, say, wait, yeah? Ah, I don't come up forgetting you'll be wrong number. Mm. I know how it's me, you know. If I see the money, I could check on. Ah. Hmm? The next time that man tries to stop me on my way again, I won't even say what I would do to him. They say how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. Babe, you take things too serious. I want the best for you. I just, I just want your sister to come and assist us, that's all. Okay, can you just plead with your sister to come? Can you just do that? You think the best thing is for my sister to come here to assist me, right? Yes, I have my reasons. me that, that idiot played with my emotions my intelligence no no Justin no 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 you see I have always told you to let that girl be she's too responsible to accept you get that into your skull you should know that by now Oh, oh, you're, you're, you're trying to say I'm irresponsible, right? I'm irre Say it to my face, I'm irresponsible. Hey, no, 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 no. That would be unfair to say that. You're my friend. Birds of the same feather flocks together. So if I say you're irresponsible, automatically I am irresponsible. Check on me. I'm only advising you yeah, as a friend. Anywhere I set my eyes on that girl, she must pay me back my money in full. Justin, if you listen to me, let that girl be. If you ever stop on the way, she will insult you. Move on. Just move on. Why are you, why are you so defending her? You're supposed to be on my side, man. Wait, have, have, you, have you seen that girl? She looks carried away. Have you seen her recently? You see, you see, you see, in life, it is not everything you want that you get, no matter how hard you try. Believe me. Lucy will never, ever accept you. There are many victims everywhere now. Omo, bounce on them now. It shouldn't be Lucy. I'm not, I'm not defending her. I'm not, I'm not taking sides. I'm not holding brief. But I'm only being truthful. That girl is too responsible. There are many Olosho everywhere now. You, you know, know your way now. As my guy, I'm beginning to suspect you. Do you have an eye for that girl? Uh, Why? Because you, you tend to be on the defensive side. I like them big. She's not big. I like them fleshy. She's not fleshy. So I understand. I understand what you said. It's not everything you want in life that comes to you. But at least you should be among the ones that comes 
to me. Not nothing. This is exceptional. I want to see your madam. Again? Monday! Madam! Who is she looking for? Madam, I don't know. Oh. Let's have come. Let's have come. How might I help you? Ma, I brought you this. Please, tell your husband to leave me alone. Don't know me. <laughs> anyway, the money you gave to me, I have returned to your wife. Now, when next you see me on the road and stop me, be rest assured to get lots of insults that day. Madam, please tell your husband to leave me alone. Focus on your family. I, I, I don't even know what she is. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. She's a nobody. Okay? Let's go inside. Don't let that bother you. Come on, let's go. Girl, I, I can explain oh, it. That is not necessary. See, I already know everything that happened. Okay. You see that girl? She is a demon. A demon that the devil wants to use to destroy our home. But we will not allow her. Eh? We will not. It's okay. Just take it. Uh, Don't say anything. Like I said, I already know everything. It's not your fault. Now, enough of all that. Tell me, how was work today? Fine. It was fine. Great. <laughs> Baby, I know you're hungry, right? You know what, uh, let me just go in and prepare something for you, okay? Come here. I'll be back. No. No. I'm a woman who act like 
this. Okay, she's up to something. Oh, Justin, Justin, wake up. Justin, wake up, wake up, wake up. believe that that man's wife is the one supporting the husband to cheat on her. I, I, I can't believe it. Ha. My sister, if it's you, what will you do? You die in marriage. Hey, hey, if I marry today, if my husband likes, she carry all the girls in the world. It's not my business. As long as he's giving me money, I'm fine. Ha! Who wants to die? Hold on. Don't tell me you went to her house. I did. I mean, I'm just coming back from the house. I even gave her the money the husband gave to me. Eh? And she couldn't believe me. You gave her what? I gave her back the money now. Why? Why? I mean, what, what do you expect me to do with 100,000 Naira? Give me the money. I am bigger than that. Ah, yeah, you, you are bigger than that. Me, I'm not bigger than 500 Naira. I don't even have 200 Naira as I'm standing here. I'm not worth 100 Naira, say. What are you saying? What am I not saying? Baby, forgive me the money. Baby, who is filling your mind with social orientations? Mm -hmm. You need to turn a new leaf. I mean, Give your life to Christ. Okay. Where are you going to? I'm, I'm going to, you know, somewhere. 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 Oh, please. I'll be putting this game in my prayers. Like, she needs prayers. How are you? Fine. How is mommy and daddy? Daddy is fine, but mommy isn't fine. Yeah. What happened to her? Well, she's been working lately, so... And she's always angry all the time. Yeah. Okay, I see. Don't worry. I'm here to help her out, okay? Mm. So she'll have more time for you guys, alright? Okay. All right. Let's go inside. I'm a grown-up now. I know. Time. Yes, sir. What's up? What's up? How's mama and papa? They are fine. They send their regards. Oh, great, great, yes, great, sir. great. Hope you're good. Yes, I'm I fine. I'm happy to see you. <laughs> Go upstairs. <laughs> hey, there's, there's, there's biscuit on the table. <laughs> Take it easy. There's biscuit on the table. Biscuit? Yeah, lots of biscuit. Biscuit! Go, go, go. Come to me. Come to your papa. Work is fine. How's everything? <laughs> Babe, Sister. Jessica is here. Jessica? Yeah? Jessica, what is this? I am asking you, you are looking at me. What are you wearing? Sister, please don't start. Stop. I shouldn't start what? what? What do you mean, what am I wearing? Eh? What is it again? Jessica, what are you Jessica, how many times have I told you not to dress like this coming to my house? How would I said it before? Since have I said it? Sister, you started. This is exactly why I didn't want to come in the first place. But Mama kept insisting that I come. Oh, now, now look at what you are doing. Mwah. Jessica, it's okay. Alright? Don't mind your sister. Just go and get some rest. Alright? Please. Eh? Get which rest? Go anywhere. No, go anywhere. Where is she going to? Jessica, look at what you're doing. If I beg you to leave her now, I will just put her in touch. Look at what you're wearing. Sister, you don't let me. Get me. Stop it! 
Jessica, go to your room. Oh, I'm talking. You are safe going inside. Jessica! I said shut up! Father, I mean, what do you intend to do about it? <laughs> Man, they talk rubbish. <laughs> rubbish, rubbish, rubbish that they talk from my mouth, rubbish. By the time I go to that house and report myself to the wife, uh -huh, a body will calm down. You got pregnant for a married man and you are not even disturbed about it. <laughs> what do you want me to do? What would I do? My sister, I can handle anything. So, have you spoken to your father about it? My father. I can only talk to my father if I can't handle this. I can handle this. I don't understand. I get belay. Uh -huh. Hey, this is serious. So. My sister, it's not that serious. I can handle this. Can't you give yourself some rest? Rest? How? I need to finish doing this. How? Okay, let me help you. No, 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 no. Come on. Don't worry. I will be done soon, okay? Remember, let me help you. I insist. Please. Don't oh, worry. Uh, Jessica, are you sure about this? Uh -uh. Sister, I can wash plates. It's just plates. Okay, uh, thank you. Where is the rag? Um, I am. Um, I want to apologize about the way I spoke to you the last time. I'm sorry. No problem. I know you are troublesome. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> you are troublesome. But on a serious note, you need to change the way you dress. I mean, you're not a kid anymore. Cover up. Come look at what you're wearing. I'm not trying to make troubles, but I'm just saying. Mm -hmm. Just go and sleep. Mm? I should go and sleep. Go and sleep. I'm not joking. Mm, I know. Put on some jackets. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, thank you. I'll be upstairs if you need anything. Darling, let me get to you. Where are you going to with those clothes by this time of the night? I'm going to wash them. Here. Do you want to kill yourself? Is this how you live? Oh. My dear, if I don't wash them, who will? You want me to wake my husband up to go and wash the clothes? I have to do it myself. Sister, please. Is that not what I'm here? Let me have them. I'll wash them in the morning. Hey. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you so much. You don't know what this means to me. Please go and rest. All right. And you make sure you go to bed. Yes, I will. Thank you. I'll give you the in the morning. No problem. Thanks. Don't you kill yourself with work.
baby. Mm. You sleeping? Yes, fast asleep. Right. Mm. Um, looks like Jessica has taken the other kids to school. Mm -hmm. She did. Without waiting for the school bus to arrive. I am super excited. Wow. You know, the thought of just going to the market without stress today mm -hmm. is awesome. I can't even believe it. It's been a long time. I had a kind of... Feeling. This is the type of life I want you to live. A stress-free life. And that is exactly what I want for myself. Meanwhile, since we're going out together, you will drop me in the shop before you go to your office. I'll do anything for you. We have to enjoy this marriage. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, so shall we? I've been waiting for you. Um, Baba! Mm. Baba! Madame! Come. They must call you three times before you answer. Why? Sorry, sorry. Listen, we're leaving. When Jessica comes back, tell her to come to the shop to come pick up the baby. Did you hear me? And make sure you don't forget. For what? At this junction, I dare not. Hey, Bannon. Honey, let's go. Please get my bag. Honey, let's okay. go. It's on the chair. Oh. By the door, okay? Mm. 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 <laughs> oh, she's very happy. I mean, she does virtually nothing at home. Her sister is helping her with uh, the house chores, and yeah. <laughs> you see, that is one thing I like about Jessica. Mm. She's very hardworking, even in the village. She does farm work like no man's business. She even took the kids to school before their school bus arrived. That is funny. <laughs> but I just hope your wife will allow us to. Uh, I don't think she'll let her go. Yes, because she's enjoying all the rest. She's getting. Well, if you say so. So, how far are you done with the file? I no, no, you? no. Emeka, I'm not touching that file today. I'll do that tomorrow because I have. Uh, I need to go to a spa. I need to and take care of myself. I'm really tired. I need some some body massage. <laughs> okay, there's no problem now. So, when you are done, let me know. I'll let you know. Mm. I'll let you know. Don't worry. <laughs> He is one of the most beautiful things that have happened to me in recent years. Uju, are you being sarcastic here? Sarcastic? Oh no, come on girl. It's my husband we are talking about here. You should be talking about divorcing this man for heaven's sake. The fact that you know that he is a chronic humanizer. I don't, <laughs> I don't understand. <laughs> Cynthia, you know you're actually sounding very funny right now. You know that, right? Listen, I have made a mistake once in my life. I am not ready to repeat it. Okay, fine. I wish you good luck. Yeah. <laughs> mm. Justin. Justin, what's the matter with you? My wife's been acting strange. I don't seem to understand her anymore. What is she up to this time? You, you know, the, the, the devil's incarnate, Lucy, took the money I gave to her and presented it to my wife. What? Is she, is she mad? I, 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 don't, I don't even know. I, I think the devil, is, the devil is trying to use her. The devil is trying to use her. And the greatest part is that my wife collected this money and waved it as if nothing happened. Man, that 
very strange. She could be up to something dangerous if you ask me. Exactly. Exactly my thought. Exactly my thought. I, I, I think she has plans to kill me. I think she has plans to kill me. You know, I can even sleep in peace in my house again. Justin, though your wife may look innocent, but you have to be very, very careful. Very careful. Do you know that I even go to sleep with one eye open? Just be careful, okay? Just be careful. What kind of mess have I got myself into? It's okay, it's okay. Just, just don't get yourself worked up, okay? You have to sort those things out, okay? Take it easy, take it easy. Just be careful, that's all. Be careful. Hmm? Be careful. Women, women, you never can tell. What is it? What is it? I know you will not last up to one month in this house. Yes. And I'm sure about that. If you know you want to last for four days in this house, you have to change the mode of your dressing. Are you mad? Seriously, am I the one you're talking to? Oh, man. Um... Something is wrong with you. Chuma. For you to open it, your stupid mouth and say those gibberish to me. Hey! Because I did not say anything gibberish from my mouth. I did not say anything. I said, get the mode of your dress. You know, something so? is wrong with you. Chuma. The next time you open this stupid mouth of yours to say such rubbish to me, I will make sure my sister sack you. Idiot. Foolish man. In my sister's house. Open for you. Who else heard gibberish now? Now, now, now. I did not say anything gibberish. It did not come out from my mouth. If from all that I said here, you pick nothing but gibberish, that means. Look at the gibberish here. What is gibberish? Oh, go gibberish! Go on gibberish! 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 Go on gibberish! Yes! Don't go on gibberish! Yeah. Oh, when um, at this junction, at this junction, I lost it. Demolition. Confused 
and at the same time, uh, 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 surprise. May you remain confused for the rest of your life. Oh, man, no. Are you sick or something? How can you, the chief security of this house, tell me you don't know what is going on here or how the music started playing while you are the one guiding this house? Are you high on something, chief? Hey, hey, at this junction, I will have to say the truth. Down. Is your sister out? Uh, hey, down. Is your sister? She is the only one in the house. Uh, 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 yes. Jessica! Jessica! Oh, yes, yes. Jessica! decided to bring my roof down. Now you listen, this set has been bought for three good years and it has never been played this loud. I wouldn't want it to repeat itself again. Do I make myself clear? Sister, what's wrong with having fun? It's just music. Next time, bring it low. Fine. What is this? What is what? What are you wearing? Why are you naked? Sister, how am I naked? Oh, excuse me. Do you know my husband can actually walk in here? Come back from work and see you dressed like this. What is wrong with how I'm dressed? I'm at home for crying out loud. No. Not in my house. You would not dress like this in my own house. I For goodness sake, Jessica, I am married and I have a husband. You cannot dress like this while in my place. Sister, please. This is how I like to dress. Papa could not change me, so what makes you think that you want to, to change me now? Why? Well, my darling, if you have to continue staying here, you can't keep dressing like this. Do I make myself clear? Really? Yes. Why are you sounding like I'm begging you to stay in your house? I am the one rendering help to you, right? Oh, so please, in the name of rendering help, you want to dress like a prostitute in my house, all naked? Hell no, that would not happen. You would not continue to stay in my house dressed like this. If you need to stay here, you will be all covered up. If need be, wear a jalabia every time you are in my house. Do I make myself clear? Fine, I will leave. I'm not begging to stay in your house. What is all this? Please. I will leave. I will leave. After all, I told my mother I was not going to stay here. She my begged me to go. It's better you leave. Please pack your things and go. I will go. Use this for your transport. I don't need your money. Hope you know that. When my in-law comes back, tell him I've left. Oh, wait, wait. At least if you don't want to take the money, get something for mama on your way back home. She is your mother. If you need to send her money, you know how to go about it. Jessica, what is wrong with you? Jessica! There is too much drama in some homes today. Plenty wahala in some families today. Sometimes it's from the man or from the woman. Some women may get
Where's Jessica? She's gone. She's gone. Mm. She's gone. You couldn't even let her stay for one week. Nobody chased her in. She went and left. You have sworn not to let any maid into this house. Listen, Angoli, if you faint again, you'll never see me there until you die or return. So you can let me die. Let me die. If that is what you want, let me die. Well, don't die in my house. Go to your father's house and die. Not in this house. Don't put me into trouble. Just say it. Tell me you don't want me anymore. Say it to my face. I mean, you don't even have to say it. I know. Can you hear yourself? You sound like you're losing it. You're out of control. Yes. You know what? It's better for you to choose between having a maid in this house or having me as your wife. It's that simple. If you don't want me anymore, let me go back to my father's house. What is it? I said I don't need a maid. Do I have to sink it? You are making me go mad as we can. Leave me alone. I'm not making you go mad. You're mad already. Jesus. Yes, you are. You act it. You, 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 you act as if you stuck really I mad. I am not getting a maid. And that is final. Except you want me to run into the streets. Let me go back. I will not stop. No one will come into this home. I have been here for years. There is no one that will come into this home. There is too much drama in some homes today. Plenty wahala in some families today. Sometimes it's from the man or from the woman. Some women they get wahala. They will choose their career over their husband's way and hand over the home to their housemates and hand over or God to their housemates. Jessica, Mama. some housemates. <laughs> I said it. I knew it. I know you. We are not going to spend up to one week in that house. It's not my photo. I know. It's my fault. Nebe Juan, your fault, Kagini Mezia. It's not your fault, my daughter. Lekwe Wem is my fault. Eh? It's my own fault. Mama, see, I cannot stay where I'm not accepted. Sister's insecurity is the highest I've seen since I was born. What? Eh? I knew you took your indecent dressing to her house. So, how do you expect her? How do you expect her to be happy with you? You should have told me that I, I was going there to receive home training. Is there anyone above home training? Sister. Uh. Sister Angurika is the one that needs home training. Uh. She needs to be taught properly on how to manage her emotional and mental insecurity. Mama, her insecurity is the highest. Highest I've seen since I was born. Uh. Uh. Oh, give me respect, Obia. Oh my tenenu ma kuoge ibaroto na akpagari fanyeni kan ohu na akpagari akpagari na na bedia if fanyeni kan ohu ina akpagari na bedia okuya sorry for yourself sorry yo sister angrika is a santa mes ara pukwa ga ba yama chugu na mere ma adi mebu benanya Hey, sir. Hey, how are you doing? I'm fine. Why are you standing? Where are you headed? Um, I'm going somewhere. I want to pick something. I'm waiting for the cab to come. 
Oh, um, all right, come in, hop in, let me drop you. Oh, come on, come on, just go there. left where you're going to just to drop me here oh no come on it's nothing i mean i know i'm behind schedule or anything for my wife's friend thank you so much i appreciate it you're welcome <laughs> trust me you you're beautiful and you got great smiles Yeah, you sure do look handsome. Thank you. Okay. So how are you guys doing? Fine. You want to tell me anything? Mm, yes, Dad. What is it? Alright, Dad, look. Ever since we came back, we haven't seen Auntie Jessica. Oh, okay. So, cozy. Her belongings are no more longer in yeah. the room. Yeah. So, sure. has she gone? I don't know. Dad? Yeah, your mother sent, sent her away. No, 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 no. Dad, please, what? you have to bring her back home. Please, Dad. Okay, look, Dad, she always helps us with our assignments. And we always go to school, come back. We get an A, we always score a high score, good score, and we're always happy. But look, mom can't do that for us because she's always tired, working, she doesn't have time for, you know, to do our assignments. for you, yeah. Yeah. So now I just want you to help us to bring her back home so she can help us. Please. Uh, anytime we write our assignment ourselves, we end up scoring zero. She's you score good. zero? Yes. Because she's no longer here. Uh, yeah, that's what you said. No, 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 no I didn't say that. Yeah. But we always score zero normally. Uh, or one, or two, or three. So she helps you with your assignments? Yes. That's why. So you... anytime she's around, you do well in school. That's what you say? Yeah. Please, Dad. Mm. Please tell Mom to bring her home. Please. Please. That's okay. <laughs> so Dad, what are you watching? Nothing. I'm not watching anything. I'm watching you. Watching me? You need you need a haircut.
Osa, you know my sister is very difficult to stay with. I understand, but I need you to help out. She, she's actually going through a lot of stress. And it's affecting her relationship with everyone. Mama says she will come and spend some time with you guys. I think she will be all right. Mama is getting old. And I don't think it's appropriate, you know, to let Mama do all those chores in the house. I, I, I don't know. You just need to help out, please. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My mind is made up, please. In that case, uh, I guess I'll have to wait for Mama. Okay. Should I get you anything? Water is fine. Okay, sir. Thank you. I bought this for you and this one for you. <laughs> Don't you like it? Well, I like it, but that's not the problem. What is the problem? Organic. I want to ask you something. Well, are you happy staying in the city without us? Or do you not mean anything to you? whole world to me. It's just that it's not in my powers to take you. If not, I would have taken you with me. Eh? Mommy, we are not happy leaving you without you. We want you back. You have done anything to wrong to you. Just forgive us. We want to, I want to stay with you in this city. Like, are you happy seeing us like this? Look at us now. Look at your children. Has it been with your new home? It's not been better, Mama. Justin, my husband, is always sleeping around with different women. <laughs> In fact, he is the worst I've ever seen. Mm -hmm. It would surprise me if you said he is not. Mm -hmm. Lying and cheating. Give it to me. That's the pioneer of extramarital relationships. But Mama, <laughs> why, why are they like that? Men are told and they are brought up and they believe they are the heads of the family. But some misinterpret it. Yes. Some take it that being head gives them the right to do anything they like whether the other person likes it or not. But no. And uh, this idea of uh, seeing women as lower beings <laughs> ah, makes some men disrespect women a lot. Yes. All these old narratives make many men so disgusting. Yes. Mama, yes. how do we change that? How do we convince these men to see women that we are not trees? How do we make them understand that we have feelings too? How? My dear, you younger women that are still giving birth should raise up men differently. Make them understand and see women as fragile beings that need love and care. Hmm? They need to take very good care of their women. You see, to a woman or a girl child is brought up to see the husband eh, as her crown and the pride of her womanhood. But the men? <laughs> The man is to get a woman and make her his first priority. That's why you can get a man, a man will so love you, 
give you everything. I mean everything, but still cheat on you. That's meant for you. But men should be made to understand that women are their thrones. Have you ever seen a king without a throne? Or any king with multiple thrones? No. Let's just see the women as their throne. Take good care of them. That's the only thing that can change it, my dear. How do we go about this? <laughs> we, the young women, are now suffering from this wrong upbringing you're talking about. How do we save ourselves oh. from all this? How? How do we do it? Love conquers all. Love, my dear. Love. I don't think love is enough. Because I, I show him love, it's not working. It's like the more I show him love, the more he cheats. Right now, <sighs> I don't even know what to do again. Love killed Samson through Delilah. And love saved us all through Jesus Christ. So love, only love can tame the wild carnivorous animal and turn it into a tamed one, a domestic animal that we now live with. Only love, my dear. Love can do it all. going to visit people. At least this bag doesn't look like you came to uh, do surprise. This bag is big. You should have called me to tell me you were coming. Don't worry yourself. I have come to stay at least three months. It's a guinea. Oh, wait on. Three Baby, did you? Are you aware of this? Le Le I'm sorry, I should have told you. It's my fault. I forgot. No, no it's not about it being your fault. She made up her mind to come and spend three months here. Mama, mm. be good, eh? Three months is a long time for you to come and spend in somebody's house. You cannot... I mean, who takes care of your farm in the village? Who takes care of the house? How can you leave your house for a whole three months and come and... Are you coming for Mugwa? These children are big. What are you coming to do? Three months is too long for you to spend here now. If you at least you stay one day or two days and then you go back to your house. How can you come here to, to, to spend three months? So, I should go back to the village. No, it's better. It's better you say it to go here. Three months is too long. How can she stay here for three months? Bring my bag. Mama, that's Mama. Bring my bag. Let me go Mama, back listen, to the village. Listen to me. Let me go back to the village. Mama, listen. It, ha it hasn't gotten to that. Uh -uh. It hasn't gotten to that. Okay, I'll handle this. Please, it's okay. Three months is too much for her to spend in this house. That is what I am saying. She cannot be here for three months. Uh -uh. It's yeah. okay. It, Mama, come. No! I'm going back to the village. Mama, listen to me. Mama, it's, yeah. it's, it's better, okay. It's better come. you go. Or does it look like an amuse amusement park? How can you come and spend three months in somebody's house? That's enough. Hey! It's not enough. I said it's enough. How can you bring her to come and spend three whole months here? Three but, months. But I, I just apologized. I told you I forgot. 
when you have to tell her to go back three months. That's you know. Anoli, you're getting on my nerves now. Okay, I won't talk. I, I won't say anything again. But, but, but three, three months is too much. You're embarrassing me. Stop it. Yeah. Can I get a minute of your time, please? How may I help you? Um, has someone ever told you that you're the most beautiful creature on this planet? Yeah. My husband tells me that every day. Husband? Oh, you're married? Yes. The ring should have told you that already. <sighs> you are not visually impaired, are you? Oh, no. Um, I, I know they say love is blind, but um, trust me, we can mingle if you don't mind. Mingo. Oh, yes. Even when I'm married? Uh, we, we're adults and um, I know it's a thing of choice, if you don't mind. You must be a very stupid man. You are married, yet you want to sleep with another man's wife. What happened to your wife? Uh, listen, to, uh, you don't need to go hard on me, okay? I'm just in the money, man, and I can do anything. I mean, anything for you. Really? Oh, yes. Trust the money, man. I think you should take your manhood to your wife. She should be the one, the only one, to have access to it. Say, I can give you money, love, anything. Okay. Just name it and it will be at your doorstep. Oga, take all the packages you want to give me and go and give to your wife. She's the one that wants it. She deserves them, not me. Idiot. Look, 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 at, look at someone I'm trying to help. Money, everything, you're on a platter of gold and you're done. This is unacceptable. Grandma taught you how to wash plates. Yes, Mama. Why? That's cool, Mama. That's... Look, Mom, I can even run errands for you. I can even help you with the house chores. Besides, I'm having no problems. I'm grown up now, Mom. Look you at me. You are grown up. Yeah, I'm a big boy. Thank you. <laughs> you you excuse me, I want to wash my plate. Oh. I should excuse you. I want to wash my plate. Okay, I'll get you more. Hey! Jesus. What is he doing? She made you made. Uh -uh. You want to struggle how? Hey! Out. Um, Mama. 
My son said you were teaching him how to wash plates. Why is that? Eh. Uh, uh -uh. Kelvin, how can you have such a grown-up boy and you cannot teach him some domestic uh, uh, duties? Mama, who said that he is grown-up? Is he your child? Do you know how old he is? No, I'm asking you, do you know how old he is? That boy is still too young to learn how to wash dishes. Mama, I'm Zirugi. Did I beg you? Mama. I know. That's the biggest problem she has. She thinks and feels she does anything better than any other person. Is that what you think? Anyway, for your information, Teacher Wan Joko, the boy you taught how to wash plates did not even wash those dishes properly. So next time, do your work well, if you want to. Kevin has been the one washing the whole thing for the past two days, and we have been enjoying it. Hey, uh, Mama, before you start enjoying Biko, you did not come to my house to come and raise my kids for me. Allow me to do my job. Don't teach my son how to do anything again. Please! Hey! Anna. My dear, as you can see, my son-in-law and the I, we are busy doing something before you came in. Before you interrupted us. Oh? Nangwa. Hi! Um, Why did we go? Mama. <laughs> mama, Mama. What? Mama? Wait now. Please, uh, excuse me. I want to have a word with my husband. Uh, I said I want to have a word with my husband. Nah, I'm coming. Okay. No problem. Hey! <laughs> Bia, Azubiki, what is the meaning of that? What exactly were you two watching on your phone? Are you people were just laughing and, 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 and bringing home the whole house? Eh? Angulika, what did it look like we were doing? Were you not here? Huh? You know the thing about you? You take things so easily. Life is just so easy for you. You don't care to know how people feel about it. Is that how you see life? You have the spirit of jealousy. <clears throat> yes. Is that so? You have jealousy inside of you. And you have to be very careful so that it doesn't land you into trouble. Land me into trouble? Yes. You are the one that will get into trouble. Look at the way you were close to a woman old enough to be your own mother. Why were you laughing with her like that? Have you ever in your life showed me something on your phone? If I go close to your phone, you hold your phone. Have you showed me anything on your phone and laughed with me like this before? I can't believe we're having this conversation. No, we're having this conversation. No. Asubike, we are having this conversation. If I hold your phone, you will drag your phone. Now you are so close to my mother, showing her and laughing. I see you people are enjoying what is on that. Your mother is very friendly. Oh, more with dragon. Yes, your mother is very friendly. No, I'm a dragon now. Your mother is very friendly. I am not friendly. Your mother is very no friendly. Problem. Yes. You see the end of this. I can't believe we're having this conversation. Honestly. I can't believe you have such thoughts. There are things I need to buy. Mama, mm. do you know your way to the market? No. I think I'll take taxi. Mama. You must inform me before you go out. Because when you go out and those hoodlums on the street find out you don't know your way, it's easier for them to do something bad to you. Okay, come and take me.
照片。Where is my mother? Hmm? I wasn't speaking Spanish. I said, where is my mother? Oh. She went out. She went out? With who? I mean, where? Where did she, did she tell you where she's going? At this John John. Okay, speak. There is no junction here. Did she tell you where she's going? Uh, madam, my duty in this house uh, is minding the gates. I cannot ask a guy where he's going to, who he's going out with, and why he's leaving off the full year. Uh, can my dad know when? Uh, wait, 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 wait a minute. By that, you mean my, my mother went out with my husband? Mm -hmm. uh, speak up before I hit you. Uh, yes. Wait, where did they go to? Did they tell you where they were going? I mean, when did they leave the house? Where did they go to? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Office again. Get lost. Oh. Market. Huh? Do, it's a guinea. Hey! Since when did you turn to a driver? You took my mother to the market. Since when? A mama? Huh? So my husband took you to the market and you comfortably sat in the car for my husband to drive me in the market. As what? I am asking, as what? Since when did this start? Hey! was you see you, this is your eye. I'm going for a nyaga. This is your eye that I'm looking at. Hey, that thing you are looking for, you will find it in hundred folds. You took my mother to the market. Since when? Have you ever driven me to the market? I am asking you, have you ever taken me to the market? Mama, well done. Thank you. No problem. What is it? Mama, don't ah. worry, I'll ask the, the gate man. What is she talking about? Leave her. Let me tell the gate man to bring him. Mm. He said his own mama Biko. Who is she, Mbaka? Who is she? Mama, I don't know. Mama, she's not here. Angulika, what were you thinking? That's your mother for crying out loud. She came downstairs and said she wanted to go to the market. I had to take her to the market. Oh, no, congratulations, taxi driver. Suddenly you now take my mother to the market. Why is that? That was when you were so happy when my mother came to the city. Before she came here, I used to go to the market. Don't I? Don't I go to the market to get full stop? What is the meaning of this? At least you should have told me. Anguli. Why do you always conceive stupid things in your head? No, tell me. I, are you trying to say I, 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 I took your mother to the hotel? Ha! Is that what you're saying? Ha! I said, okay. That is not what I said. Please, Biko, don't put words in my mouth. I did not say that. No, but what, what are you insinuating? Ha. Are you trying to... Okay, tell me. What would I possibly do with your aged mother? I'll do one. What? Why are you asking me? Are you having a breaky conscience? Asubike, I'm asking you. Are you having a breaky conscience? Why are you asking me? You're unbelievable. Thank you. You are unbelievable. Mm -hmm. It does not end here. Oh. You will not have a lot back in next time. It will not happen.
sent you. Hi. How have you been? I'm good. Well, well, um, like I'm right on time. Were you looking for me? Uh, it's, it's obvious. Um, permit me to, to sort this out. Uh, don't worry. I don't need to bother you with this. I'll do it. Oh, uh, no. Please just let me be the gentleman. Um, sorry, can you calculate both and let me have the bill? Okay, for her, her phone is uh, 42, 500. I'll calculate both and let me know. Wow, man, you, you. You, you look it so astonishing all the time. <laughs> I've already ordered for both. Oh no, come on, you don't need to do that. Um, permit me to take you wherever you're going to. I don't need to disturb you with that, okay? No. Let the boris and the body be mine, okay? I'm not complaining, all right? For a charming pretty lady like you, I'll take the opportunity to want to drop you wherever you're going, so, shall we? with this closeness between my husband and my mother. They are just too close for comfort and I and I'm very uncomfortable. I don't like it. Wait, wait, only wait. This is unbelievable. Gine. Are you suspecting your husband and your mom? Yeah. Did I say that? I didn't say that. You you don't even know my husband. You don't know the person he is. I I know the man I live with. I know who I'm talking about. I you, you don't you don't just understand it. This is not good at all. But tell me, did you tell your husband of about it? Of course I did. Why won't I? See, when my husband is a chronic cheat. I know the man I live with. Of course I, I, I had to tell him. I know you know your husband. But I feel maybe there are things in the past you're holding against your husband. Yes, because I don't know how you started your home. I had nothing when I got into my home. In my home, I found fulfillment. I found joy. What do you expect me to do? I should protect it with everything in me. I know. I understand. But you're being overprotective. You're protecting your husband too much. And that might bring doom. God forbid. Chinwe. Yes. I'm saying the truth. You have to stop it. You're protecting that man too much. Even the animals, they need space. They need air to breathe well. That is what I'm trying to say. Hello? Who's this? I'm sorry, I didn't know it was you. So please, can you give me more time, please? I promise I'll pay you back. So please. Thank you, sir. How much are you owing him? Don't worry. Too much 
I think it's too much for such a pretty, charming lady like you. Thank you so much, sir. I'll forever be grateful for this. You don't need to thank me. The thing is, I don't want my wife to know about this. But she's my best friend and I think it would be better I tell her. You know the saying, what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas? Meaning we have to keep this relationship private. It's okay. I understand. Okay. Better. Best. I mean, she wants mother. Uh, how about you stopping by the house and uh, maybe prepare a good meal for me? Uh, that would be nice, trust me. I don't have anything in the house, so I think it's better we stop by and get food. Uh, not a problem. <laughs> we could do that, and now that can have um, both meals together. <laughs> Once again, thank you. You're always welcome. You know you're beautiful, you got a great smile. You know I can't take my eyes off you. Hey, you're my friend's husband. Yeah, nah, just let that go. Come on. I shouldn't stand as a barrier. I really do like you. I want to take very good care of you. I miss our family. We used to be together and I enjoy those moments we spent together. I wish you can come together again. Yes, mommy, we cry every day for this. I know. It's just that we may not come back together again. You know, because your father is married to another woman. And I am married to another man. So it's... It's... <sighs> Mommy, we will grow like this for the rest of our lives. Mommy, it's not fair. Why are you blaming me? It's not my fault. Does it matter who forces it? It's just not fair. It's not fair. Are you 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 commented hey. telling the food funny? Ah, you people have done eating. Huh? Yes, Mama. How is the food? <laughs> Mama, it, was uh, it was good. It was good. It was okay. Mama, I was going to say my wife cooks well, yeah. but your food is sweeter. Thank you. <laughs> what is it? Azubike. Huh? A woman never gets too old to dance to a rhythm that she has mastered. Yeah. Kitchen experience my presence whenever I go in. Mm -hmm. uh, where are you going? I don't know. <laughs> Your wife is jealous again, no? Oh? Mama, you have seen what I've been going through in this house. Huh? You have to take it easy with her. Yeah. You are a man. I think you should learn how to win her trust. Mm -hmm. I believe if you learn how to win her trust, she will stop all Mama. this. And um, Rico, uh, you have tried, eh? We have enjoyed you so much. We have enjoyed your stay here. Uh? Biko, first thing tomorrow morning, hmm? you pack your things and go back to the village. Mm. 
How dare you say that to me? Or can I see how dare? Mama Pico, so that you will not waste time tomorrow morning. First birds leave at six. Pack your things this night. First thing tomorrow morning, I am taking you to the park. You will not try that nonsense with me. Hey! I will not do that. I cannot do that. Angrika, don't push me. If you push me, I will go to the village and tell all the villagers that you accused me of sleeping with your husband. Hey! Yes, Mama! Mom, I did not say that. Oh. Biko, all I said is pack your things and go back to... Mama, go back now. Eh? She, you have a farm to take care of. Your fowl, your chicken, everything, they miss you. Go back to your village and stay with your husband. Leave my husband's house for I me. will not try it. Mama, you will leave. Angreka. Mama, I will leave you want to kill that madness. Mama, you will leave. I will kill that madness. Your you husband's house. What is wrong Mama, with you? Let me get the door open. Mama, Mama take his house. If you are possessed, I will beat you out of I will beat that for Hey! Angreka. Angreka. You keep quiet. You didn't say anything. Azubike, whether you like it or not, Mama is leaving this house tomorrow. First thing tomorrow morning, please. Do you ever get dressed? Get some rest. Huh? You have you given me any rest? No, oh, but. Azubike, have you given me any rest? I am asking. Why would I rest? I am not going to rest. Mama cannot stay here. Mama has to leave tomorrow. Mama, can, I... Mama cannot leave this house. Azubike, say again. Because she's helping you do a lot of Did things. Did I beg her? Did I beg her to help me do anything? Have I not been running every errand in this house? Have I not been doing anything? Why do you always look for a way to make me act like I'm, like I'm, I'm, I'm a crazy woman? She has my father to take care of in the village. Let her go back there and take care of my father mm. and leave my house for me. Sorry, Mama cannot go back. She's helping with school runs. And that's very important. Yes. Hey. Listen, your nagging is getting me crazy. Can you stop? Please. Hey, wo. Hey, wo. Mom, that is all you have to say. No, that is all you have to say. Ngwa no so wadi wrong. But you see you. You, Ngwa wa asubike. You are yet to explain to me why Mama traveled all the way from the village to the city without my consent to my own house. But there's no problem. The truth, or quite the truth, it will soon be unveiled. Oh, <laughs> Things are getting out of hand. I've tried to tolerate her, but she keeps pushing me too hard. See, Azubike, you just have to take things easy. Listen, my father told me that every woman has a problem. All you need to do is to learn how to handle the one you have. Mm -hmm. If you bring another woman today, if you still don't learn how to handle her, you will still have the same problem with her. So the best thing to do is to learn how to handle your wife. Huh? Emeka, thank you for your advice. I totally agree with you. But at this point, I can't handle Anguli. It's impossible to handle her, don't you understand? <laughs> now, let me ask you. Yes. Do you want to take another wife? No. God forbid. I don't have any intention to do that. Good. Then you need to calm down. Learn how to manage your home. Huh? If possible, change her. Huh? Emeka, you don't understand, do you? It's impossible to change Angolika. And at this point, I'm fed up. I'm tired. You don't need to be tired. You need to work harder. Hmm? Try more. Some decisions we make are favorable to us. But in most cases, it hurts people we don't want to hurt at all. <sighs> So how, how do I amend this right now? Eh? I never really thought about how my children would feel before I left. So what, what do I do? <sighs> my daughter, if you had left when they were younger, 
they won't feel this bad. If you had left because of domestic violence, they won't blame you much. Ah, but you left when? They are too little, even presently. They are too young to understand what cheating means that would make you their mother leave them. So, Mama, that's the problem. That is what I'm saying. So what, what do I do now? Mm. It has already happened. And the way it seems now, it's like I cannot even change anything. Or, <sighs> Mama, should I talk to my husband to see reasons they should come and stay with me? You cannot change anything. You can't. You just have to love them. Allow them grow. With time, hmm? they will understand everything, even without much explanation. But it seems they want to stay close to me or their father. You know how addicted your husband is to women. Oma is no longer a child. She's growing into an adorable, beautiful girl. Anything can happen, and that will be worse than what had already happened. So please, for that reason alone, you are not taking them out from here. Please, eh? my daughter, you just have to hmm? love them more, show them love, eh? visit them more often. They will know how much you love them. When they are of age, they will understand that you did what you had to do. Oh, oh. Yes, thank you. Madam, wait. Madam, no, there also. I never told you I'm here to see you, madam. You know they come here when my mother knows their house. Are you mad? I know they like, Are you sick? How do you ask me that stupid question? Is this my first time coming to this house? Madam, I only tell you say my mother knows their house. Shut up! If you ever talk to me again in that tone, I swear to God you'll not like what I would do to you. Idiot. I only tell you say my brother know that so I know why it's the best. Don't let me confess how I went with the mother and not there. the way you sound as if this is my first time here. Um, we would know your visitation here has always been for my wife, but this is special to me. Just, you're here for me. I don't have much time to waste here. I only came here to thank you for the huge burden you lifted off my shoulders. Um, <laughs> come on, that's, 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 it's nothing. I mean, there's much more from where that came from. Did you just called that huge amount of money nothing? No. That huge amount of money that I received without doing nothing and you said nothing? <laughs> Say something to me. Listen, let me. You see, there is much more from where that came from. If only you were said to be I don't understand what you're saying. I don't understand, please. You know, um, I will make you understand 
Just so please stop. Let's see. I'll give you much more than what I've given to you. Okay. So please stop. Listen, stop. Relax. Just relax. Come this way, come, wait, wait, wait. Let me see, let me see, wait, wait. Uh, my eyes. Your eyes, what happened to your eyes? I don't know, I don't know, something fell into my eyes. Uh, uh, wait, wait, mama, wait, oh wait. God, oh mama, wait, 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 let me see. you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was looking out for myself, trying to please myself. Now I realize that there's no gain in causing all this pain. Oh, what a shame Oh, now I have myself to blame Because all my efforts have been in vain
it's obvious you don't have anything to say. But I want to specially thank you, my dear friend, for finding time to come to my matrimonial home to have a taste of my husband. Thank you. You are such a fantastic friend. Even after advising me to leave him because he was cheating on me. <sighs> you are such a special friend. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's not what you think, please. <sighs> so, you tell me what it is. You were advising me to leave my husband so you can come in and take over. How? Take your things and leave. Take your things. Sorry. I, I am really sorry for putting you through this. I know you're a good man. And you would never cheat on me. But I cursed it. Because I stayed away for too long. I'm sorry. My love, please forgive me. Please. Forgive me. Now, just just tell me anything I can do, you know, to, to make it up to you. Any kind of food you want me to cook or let me just do something. Please. My love, please. I'm, I'm sorry. Just tell me the kind of food you want. See, I'm, I'm going to do anything. I'm, I'll do it. Any, any, anything. Anything. Any Anything. kind of food. Okay, I'll, I'll do it. Was that my husband? Yes, ma'am. Where is he going to? Uh, I don't know. Maybe he's going to wait big pass him. Or him wait big pass the push one. Mama, 
Mama, listen. I, 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 please. Sorry. I, I apologize for the embarrassment. Okay? But don't leave us. Don't leave. And think of what people would say. They, they might say it is true. Mama, please. Mama, Biko, please. Leave me alone. Leave me alone. You don't know what this means. Eh? How will I handle this kind of shame? What will I tell my husband and his people if they get to hear this? Mama, nobody would hear. Okay, give me some time. I'll find a way to fix these problems. Please. Please. Honestly, I am going to lay a curse on her. I will lay a curse on her if this spreads to the village. Mama, it hasn't gotten to that. You can't lay a curse on her. She, she's your daughter. You can't lay a curse on your daughter, Mama. I will. Yes, I will lay a curse on her. Now I know that Aurika is possessed by evil spirits. Mama. I'm happy you, 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 you can witness what I've been going through. I, I have decided not to divorce her. I would have brought her back to you. Back to who? To you. To where? My house. I will pour hot water on both of you. Mama, please, you won't do that. It's okay. Mama, wait. Mama, Mama, I don't, Mama, I don't want you to leave. I'm leaving. Mama, please. I'm going back to my house. I am going back. I don't know that the person I called my own daughter can treat me like this in the house. I am going back. <laughs> Please, just help me call my husband. I have been calling him. He has refused to take my calls. Please. Hey, if I may ask, are you having any problem with him? Oh, Mr. Ben, you know I'll never have any problems with my husband. It's just that I caught him doing something bad. And I'm very sure he expected me to react negatively, but I didn't. I, I, I didn't at all. Because I know that to err is human and to forgive is divine. So I already forgave him. Eh? But before I could come out from the kitchen, I heard him drive out. So I, I don't even know where he's going to. Ah, uh, sorry. I want to ask you this question. What? Why do you easily forgive him when he errs? Mr. Ben, that is not important right now. All I want now is for you to just call my husband before he goes far, please. It's okay, it's okay. Please, just no, call him. Calm call down. Him. No, I'll, I'll, I'll bring him back, eh? I'll bring him back. Just calm down. Let me... I know how to find him, eh? Please. Calm down. Don't, don't overwork yourself. No, I don't, I don't want him to go far. Don't yes. worry, he won't. Hello? <laughs> My deepest fear has started to play out. What are you saying? Uh, what happened? Uh, Amoli. Uh, Amoli. Amoli. Put Amoli. yourself together and talk to me. You, 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 you would not believe what my eyes saw today. Chiwe, my heart bleeds. My... It's okay. Talk to me about it. Tell me what happened. I saw what I never believed I would ever see in my life. What did you see? How did this happen to me? Ah! Baby girl, just don't talk to me. What happened? Okay. Chime. Mm -hmm. I saw my mother. Your mother? What happened to her? I saw my own mother kissing my husband. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> 
Justin, what is this that you've done to yourself? I don't know, man. I don't. All I know is I've just shot myself in the legs. I'll never... This is the worst thing I've ever done in my life. I mean, with her friend? That is ridiculous. I mean, it could wreck her heart, you know? I know. I know, bro. The most scariest part of it is that she doesn't even show it. This behavior, this behavior of hers gets me scared. So, what do you intend to do now? I just want to run away. I, I just want to stay away for a long time. I can't, I can't face her like hurting the woman that I love so much. I wish I could make amends. Justin, I mean, running away will be counterproductive. It will hurt her the more. See, I don't know if if that's why she wants to kill me. I'm scared of my life. You see, she she might just decide to wake up one night and pay me back for all the atrocities I've done to her. I'm scared. Justin, I've never heard you. I mean, talk like this before. It just occurred to me that all the things I've done to these women, if they decide to do it to me, come on, I've got feelings. I might decide to want to strangle them. I mean, it, it, it has not been fair. I've got feelings too. You see, Justin, your wife is one of a kind. She's a limited edition. I mean, her type is rare. Just try and make things up with her, okay? I wish I could. You can. She doesn't deserve me. She does. Just have a change of leave, that's all. She's a nice woman. She doesn't deserve she me. Know, no, she she doesn't know. deserve me. No. No, 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 no. Angoli, I don't believe this. I don't. This is a very strong allegation against your mom. And you know she will not be happy if this turns out to be a lie. Does it look like I will lie against my own mother? <laughs> Does it look like I will lie against the woman who birthed me? How would I do that? Chiwi, I saw them. I saw them with my eyes. I know what I saw. My own mother, the mother that gave birth to me. Ah, Mamu. Oh, Amu, 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 just put yourself together. See, I don't want to doubt you. But you know your husband. You've been living with him. <laughs> okay, fine. If I may ask you, how did you meet your husband? Yes. This is the only way we can resolve this. How did you meet him? I didn't meet my husband in a good way. And, and that is the reason I have been so scared. Because I don't want to lose him. Same way I caught him. It's okay. It's alright. <laughs> just put yourself together. I don't want to lose my husband. You will not lose him. I don't want to lose you will not lose him. Come here. You will not. Yes. Oh, so much shame. Oh, oh, oh. Lay him there on Wemo. Lay him there on Wemo. See what I've done. 
to him. I, I just want to tell him that I bear no grudge against him. Eh, that I love him so much. I... Your husband is afraid to see you. Yeah. Guilt will not let him see you right now. Ben, uh, please. Stop! <clears throat> no. Just do me this favor. Take me to wherever he is. I, I just want to tell him that I pay no grudge, and I don't intend to harm him. Please. Okay, I, I will take you to him, but on one condition. What's the condition? Just say it, and I'll, I'll do it. Would you? Why are you acting like this? How? You see, your husband is a man, and you know, normally, when men offend their women, the ladies react. Is a natural thing. But in your own case, you don't react. And it gets him curious. I even feel curious too. He offends you. You don't, I mean, you don't, you're not angry. He cheats on you. You, you, you pretend as if nothing happens. That's Nobel. I mean, you hardly can find women like that. How do you manage to do this? Tell me, how do you manage to do it? You don't drive him, you don't. Well, you're limited if you ask me. You're a limited edition. You see, I was once married. But out of my own carelessness, I lost it. When I saw the bull dancing on top of the river, I actually thought the water was playing with it. But I never knew it was taking it away. Your husband told me you were a divorcee when he met you. Yes. Honestly, I wish I knew what I know now. I wouldn't have left my former home. But you know, sometimes we fail to refine our decisions. At last, we find ourselves in a position where we wish we could turn back the hands of time. But by then, it would have been too late for us. Can you elucidate further, please? Today, sometimes it's from the man or from the woman. Would you, you give your fish to a hungry dog? What did you expect? It was as if I handed over my home to her. But I could not believe my own husband could condescend so low as to sleeping with a common house help. How? In the world of men, there is nothing like class when sex is involved. You see, when a man is in the heat of passion, any available woman around becomes the most beautiful in his eyes. You see why you need to satisfy your husband very well before you travel? But I only left for a few weeks. Is that enough for him to quickly jump onto another woman? Is that? 
even if you had stayed for a year before coming back. You see, what keeps a man for you is when you satisfy him to the brim. But here yeah, he may he may he may he may commit one or two things, but he will clean them up before you come. Well, a situation where you did not fulfill your conjugal rights. Believe you me, he will jump on the available woman that same day you traveled. If that is a man for you. Have this strong urge. See why you need to take care of the other room. The other room business. Very important. Everything changed immediately she left. <sighs> this is the problem I have with so many working class women. They will break their husband and then leave him in the hands of the maid. That is exactly what happened. Immediately she left. Some unusual duties were added to my chores. This man wouldn't let me be. I knew it. I knew it. How will you leave your spouse and travel when you know you two are not in good terms? By the time you get back, whatever you see, you take it. Exactly. The moment she came back, she realized everything had changed. Things were no longer the same. I wish I was there. I wish I was there to see the reactions on her face when she found out that the meat she kept carelessly have been taken by the dog. I started suspecting them at that point. So, I decided to keep an eye on them. And did you start giving your husband time after you suspected that? I was naive. As a matter of fact, I got promoted at work. I started earning so much money and so many other allowances. But my husband never stopped cheating with that girl. Is it due to be sincere to you? The fault is not from your husband. You chose your work and left your home for another to manage. Your husband needed pleasure and he bounced on the available girl that was around. That's what happened. He created a lacuna. He cashed in on it. I was naive. I was busy chasing after money thinking that having lots of it will make me fulfilled. But no, I was wrong. Now I understand why wise men say that family is everything. Yeah. So did your husband chase you away to marry the maid? No. He did not. I, I caught them. What is red handed? 
Ang Uli. You mean you kept on sleeping with the man? What did you expect me to do? What was I supposed to do? We were always together. She was never around. And the kids were still too young to even understand what was happening. What would I have done? Hey! That means your husband is wayward. That is the exact reason I have been trying to curb his excesses. Because I know that if he's given the chance, he would misbehave again. Hey, but people mistake me for being too overprotective. Wait. But did it occur to you you stole another woman's husband? Stole? Yes. Chima, did I hear you say stole? Of course. I did not. She did. No, you did. She walked out on her marriage. She said she wasn't interested anymore. What was I supposed to do? Say no? I mean, honestly, I don't understand you. I don't. You think this world is like this? There is more to it. You know, sometimes I would be so happy seeing them having issues. This is so evil. You put a sonder in what God joined together. Chiwe, I wasn't mature then. I was acting with a child's mind. So now, are you saying you regret your actions? Having Azubike in my life, I would say I do not regret. He changed me. He changed my whole family. But cursing the separation, that I regret. That is why I have done everything possible to keep my husband. To make sure he stays with me forever. Hmm. If I was that woman, I will never leave my home. I will make sure you go back to where you came from. Chime, are you angry with me now? Of course I'm angry with you. Who wouldn't be angry with you? Did you listen to yourself? Eh? You broke another woman's home and you took her husband and you're saying I should be happy with you. I will never be happy with you. I pity that woman. I just pity her. Who knows what she's going through at the moment? But, hmm, she didn't act well. Though. She didn't act like a woman at all. She knew I was going to leave. I really did want to leave. You know, somehow I felt she was going to come back to fight for her home. But she never did. Hmm. And in my head, I thought she, she wanted out of the marriage from the onset. For a woman in that position to leave her family like that. I wouldn't do it. This is heavy. But you can't keep judging him for the mistakes he made in the past. Do you think so? Yes. I know my husband. He would never change. That was the same mistake Opianichu made. She was careless. I wouldn't do the same. I would fight to keep my husband. A man who can kiss a woman as old as my mother? Change? Huh? No. 
I have assessed your husband. I know he might be a womanizer, but don't you think you're doing the same thing Obianuju did? You're making the same mistake. What do you mean? Yes. You're always nagging. You're not there. You don't take care of your home. You don't take care of your children. You're always here and here. Business, this, she that. Do I really do all these things you just listed? Yes. This is exactly what your husband complained to me. You don't have time for him. You even deny him the pleasure. I'm bad. Chiwe, this business is very important to me. It's been my source of income. I mean, it's not even proper for me to ask my husband for money all the time. I take care of myself. And I extend it to my family as well. What would you have me do? Amoli, I understand. I understand everything you just said. But your family, your husband, your children, they should come first. Before your own family. These people need you. They need you. Your children need you. Your husband needs you. Please, I know you need money to do all these things, but these people should be your priority. Don't you think so? I don't just want to lose my husband. I don't want to lose him. It's alright. That was the biggest mistake of my life. I regret not heeding to the advice of Azubike and his mother. I actually thought I would find more happiness and joy as I left. You see, if he truly loves you, you do everything possible to get you back. I'm sure he would have done that. But Anguli's pregnancy got his mind divided. I'm very sure if not for her, he would have done everything to get me back. I can't. And I won't stop blaming myself. I smell... I smell love. <laughs> you... It's how they save you. You still love him. No. I, I no longer love him. It's just that I still recount my mistakes till date. And I blame myself for everything. Many years after I left and I went back home, I started making money. As a young woman, I made money. After making so much money, I then realized that my happiness and joy cannot be complete without a man by my side. And then, I started looking for a younger man who would be loyal to me. <laughs> he was my high school sweetheart. I thought going back to him would make everything okay for me. But... They say how you make your bed 
is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was looking out for myself, try to please myself. Now I realize that there's no gain in causing all this pain. Oh, what a shame. Oh, now I have myself to blame because all my efforts have been in vain. Now I feel, I feel so much pain. Oh, so much shame. Oh, lay him in a limo, lay him in a limo. See what I've done to myself. Lay him in a limo, lay him in a limo, lay him in a limo. See what I've done to myself. Before you do anything in life, che che che. Oh, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Please come in, come in, come in, come in. Oh my Here we are. Lord. Wow. You live here alone? Oh yes. Just make yourself comfortable, okay? This is now your new home. Oh, thank you. Sense. <sighs> You're welcome. Nice. Okay, thank you. Mm -hmm. I can't believe you still remember me after I'm amassing such a huge wealth. But I told you I was never going to forget you. But you did. You married someone else. That he deceived me. He promised me heaven on earth, and I fell for it. I made all this wealth through the connections and influences I got from him. After which I realized um, he never really loved me. So I, I had to leave. Do you know I cried when I heard you married another person? Mm. I nearly committed suicide. I'm so sorry I put you through that. Okay? Okay. But do you really want to hear the truth? Yes, of course. I left him because of you. Really? Yes, because I couldn't just get you off my mind. I still love you and I love you so much. And I still love you too, baby. I'll never stop loving you. Hmm. Yes. Oh, baby! Honey, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you so much. Welcome, babe. How are you? I'm fine. I can see you're fine. What are you watching? A movie. Oh. Ah, sit down. Ah. So how have you been? I've been fine. Keeping myself busy. I can see that. I bought this for you. Here. What is it this time? You know you're full of surprises. I know. Just go through them. I hope you like them. Mm -hmm. Wow, I love them. Really? Yes. Great. <laughs> I love them. Look at this one. <laughs> they're nice. Thank you so much, guys. Thank ah, you. You're mm. welcome. Mm -hmm. Mm. You're welcome. Yeah, I love them. <laughs> Have you had something to eat? Not really, not really. Okay, let me go in and make something, okay? Okay, then. Right. Thank you. Oh, I love <laughs> them. You come in and try them. Let me know if it fits. Bring them. Let's go. <laughs> <let's laughs> yeah. Oops. Okay. Okay. I play. Hey, 
Baby, you just buttered my bread. <laughs> Last card and check up. Jeez, how come? How come what? Look at it now, I won. It's so clear. Look at you it. You cheated. I cheated, how? No, now. See, 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 see. I won. <laughs> I told you I was going That's to teach you a lesson. <laughs> come on, let's okay. play it again. Okay, let's huh? play. This time I'm going to be very merciful. I'll allow you win. So, share it. Okay. Mm -hmm. And I bet you I'll win this time around. You. Okay, let's see. It's not by the... <laughs> Last card and check up. <laughs> Babe. I won. Baby, can't you see? I won. You cheated I, again. You I, I did not it. cheat. No, look at it. I did not cheat. I won. I won. Okay, fine. You, you won here. Fine. Okay. What, 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 what now? No, this. come. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. My phone is ringing. Wait, this. My phone is ringing. Uh huh. Hello. Oh, yes. Okay. No, tell them to wait. I'm coming. I'm coming. No, I'm coming. I'm coming right away. Y yes, yes. All right. Thank you. Bye. Honey, I have to run along now. My business partners are waiting for me. No, not now, baby. Tell them to come another day. Eh? Tell them to come another day? Yes. No, no. You know how the market is now. The competition out there is stiff. Eh? If I'm too busy to go and give them my products, they will go to another place. Eh? And you know how it is now. I, we need the money. So, let me go. I'll yes. see you, okay? All right, thanks. I'll see you. Yeah. I'll see you. All right, guys. <laughs> uh. Okay. So I hope you like this place. Yeah, I love it. Okay, it's nice. It. <laughs> it's nice. I love it. Yeah. Please come in out here often. You will be nice one. Oh. So this place is not like your usual village sit up, right? No, we drink Pami and the I know, Pami and Kwabi. <laughs> yeah, it's okay for us. Namdi, I'm so glad you're here. Yeah, I'm happy too. Oh, excuse me, my phone. Hello? You mean the containers are here? No, 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 no! Don't open it! Just wait until I get there. I said don't open it! Is it that you did not hear what I said? Okay, thank you. I, mean, I have to leave now. Not, not this time again, no! What do you mean by not this time? We're trying to ruin this moment. You. Every time she's running out. Hey, honey. Good morning. You slept there? Oh, tired. I had to stay back to ensure my goods are safe. You know, so I couldn't I couldn't come back. Your ditches are many. You're always on the go. I don't understand. I mean, where, where is that coming from? Do you know what it takes for me to amass the kind of wealth I have now? In case you don't know, I will tell you. It takes hard work and dedication. After all, I, I, I should be the one complaining here because you are always home doing nothing. Eh? Watching TV. I mean, who does that? This is early in the morning and you're already here watching TV. Please, please don't even go there. Don't even go there. My father told me this. And what did your father tell you? Never mind, you understand. But I think I need to go back to the village. My goats and my farm lands are calling me. How do you mean go back to the village? What, what's the meaning of that? Do you understand? Just look at this one. Who. Somebody I brought up from the village just to help his ministry. I, think I, think I, I heard that. Thank you. Eh? I, won't, I wasn't referring to you. Whatever, please. Do you know I thought he was joking? 
went out that day, and by the time I returned, he had left the house. I, I called him to know where he was, you know. He told me he had gone back to the village. <coughs> that is not even the main thing here. Do you know, the surprising thing is that he did not live with anything I bought for him. Strange. But did you find out why he left? Oh, yes, I did. He said I was maltreating him. That I was treating him as if he was poor. But I, I can't even remember doing that. But with the wealth you showered on him, that should have calmed him down. And if truly he loves you, he wouldn't have backed out so easily. That wasn't the case here. Do you know, I even went to the village to see him. He said it's better for him to stay back in the village and be with someone who will see value in him than return with me to the city where he gets love as if he's getting help. I, I, I couldn't understand it. A wise decision if you ask me. That man is a wise man with a lot of brain. Exactly the same thing my mother said. When I told her everything he said. I, I even went back to the village and I, I pleaded with him to come back with me to the city. But no, he insisted he's not coming back. I wonder why he thought I would come back to the village to stay with him. Oh, not to do, not in his wildest dream. No. So, how did you meet my friend, Justin? That? That was the day I got the biggest embarrassment of my life. Mm -hmm. I must confess, you're the most beautiful angel I have come across. Oh, please, so, can you stop? Come <laughs> on, take a look at the hair. Oh, what? I love the hair. Look, it's so sweet. <laughs> Thank you. And Thank the you. earrings. Come on, baby. <laughs> what look is at it? Me now. It's much. A rumor. Is this not the girl? No, is this not the girl? Deny it! Tony, deny it! I don't understand, honey. Who, who is this idiot? And uh, what is she talking about? Uh, uh, How oh. dare you call me idiot? You husband snatcher! Uh, Tony, say something. What is she, what uh, is she saying? Uh, I, 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 I what? Uh, hey, you have entered my trouble. Eh? In the whole husband and fat man in the whole white world. Eh? It is my own husband. We chose to cheat. No, he didn't do that. Stop, 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 stop. He did not tell me. He did not tell me anything. He did not tell me. 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 He did Thanks so much for your assistance. I mean, you are one of a kind. Oh, come on. You're always welcome. I just want to know how you're doing. I... After seeing what you went through, I think you deserve someone better. I have not really been lucky with men. I loved Tony with all my heart, but look, you saw everything that happened. Now, 
have lost faith in men. No, don't. Don't, okay? There are still few good ones out there. I don't think so. Because you have no idea what I've gone through in the hands of men. The truth is, I, I meet men almost on a daily basis, but they all end up treating me badly. So, I don't think there is anyone out there for me. Oh, no, see, you've not met someone like me. I might not be a saint, but trust me, I can't be found among such men that you've met. Okay? It's alright. Don't share those tears. Give me the smiles. Come on. It's not part of it, okay? You all is gonna be fine. Just cheer up, okay? Come on, just take a chip. So, he kept coming around. He kept showing me that he cares. Without even knowing that I was rich. He kept showing me he loves me. But by that time, I was no longer interested in men. Guilt will not let me. Guilt? Why feeling guilt at that point? I mean, you had liberty to do anything you wanted to do. You won't understand. I, I left my husband because I caught him with another woman. I slept with different men that I even lost count. Wow. That is even worse than the one person I, I, I saw my husband with. Wow. This is deep. Very deep. I how do wish couples would, would pitch tent with what you're saying now. Okay. Think about it this way. After I left my husband, I was sleeping with different men. And these men were still living with their wives. And they were also cheating on someone. And most of them had numerous girlfriends. So there is no tendency that you can find a man who will stick to you after you've left your husband's house. That is very, very deep. I mean, very deep. But are you in any way implying that uh, it is wrong for someone to divorce his spouse because they cheated? Uh, no, not at all. That is not what I'm saying. Except, if you divorce him or her, and you don't meet any other person until you get married again. But... If you divorce someone and you still go ahead to be sleeping with other people's husbands, wives, girlfriends, or even their boyfriends, what's the point? It's better for you to remain in that marriage and get it sorted. Because what's the essence of leaving a cheat for another cheat? Or you become a cheat yourself? So just, just look at it. You sound like a motivational speaker here. Wow. Now I see why you still love him irrespective of his infidelity. Ben. The truth is that at this point in my life, I just need a man. See, I, I have so much love bottled inside me. I, I just need someone I could, I could express it with. I, I just need somebody I could pour this love on. Please help. 
help me talk to my husband. I will talk to your husband. I will. And I know he will have everything. Angelica, you're using my past against me. Do you know, do you know how much I sacrificed for you? If I had wanted my ex-wife back, I would have asked her to come back. But I didn't send you away because I knew you were pregnant for me. Thank you. Thank you for not sending me away. Thank you for not sending me away, Asubike. But you listen to me. If you think I am going to close my eyes to this ungodly movement of yours, then you are in for a joke. You are a joker. What the hell do you think you are? You want to destroy my life? What do you want me to do? Of all people, my own mother. Don't touch me. Angelica, you're so unbelievable. If I wanted to flirt around, do you think you could have stopped me? Or do you think I can stop myself? Listen to me. I never liked mates. Because I feel like some of them have bad influence on children. But I allowed you to stay because I wanted to honor my wife. I never knew things would turn out to be like this. Please. Eh? I don't want you to regret anything. I beg you in the name of God. Remember, everything happens for a good reason. Why won't I regret? Everything my ex-wife did to me is the same thing Angulika is doing to me. There's no difference. Henceforth, I'm tired. I want to focus on me and me alone. No, please. Eh? I'm begging you. It be name Dinani. Please. We, we can find a solution to this. Eh? How do we solve this mess? Be gone, no, no. Listen, I've tried my best to make this work. I've tried to make her change. But she has refused to do so. Right now, I want to focus on me and me alone. I don't care where she goes. I don't care what she does. I want to focus on me. What's the big thing? can you hear my husband? Can you hear what my husband is saying? Did you hear him? Yes, I heard him. Eh? Anguli, this is the same thing I've been telling you about. You have to calm down. You have to take it easy. Do you want to lose your home? Eh? Huh. What do we do? I'm only Biko. Please. Just take it easy. Eh? <sighs> wait, wait. Is she mad? Eh? How could she think a thing like that? But I told you this. Yes. I told you, but you won't believe me. Angurika has gone crazy. Her level of insensitivity is just second to none. I can't believe this. I will not forgive her for even thinking that I could have anything to do with her husband, my son-in-law. Oh, gone, Kim. Naya, the thought of it alone is abomination. Oh, oh. Eh? I will get to the root of this. Okay, well, I will get it. Eh? But, Papa. On a second thought, I think she's having an emotional problem. What she needs is help. Oh. Urgent one. What kind of help? What kind of emotional problems? Eh? If she like, let her be mad roaming the streets. Yeah, I don't care. Huh? Eh? All I know is that I cannot and they can never forgive her. I will not forgive her for laying such a huge accusation against me. Mwa Nea. Hey! Uh, mm -hmm. I will make some inquiries mm -hmm. before I will conclude on what to do. Because I got my banquet. Huh? 
As in that dear one of Kadimuma. Azubike, don't tell me you are still like this. Eh? Do you want to develop a high blood pressure because of a woman? Emeka, Angulika is trying to destroy my life. She has proven to me that she's worse than my first wife. Would you? See. Comparison will not bring any solution to this. Just keep keep on keep And Mecca, I don't care about solutions anymore. I just want to move on with my life and focus on what comes next. See, Azubike, you know that won't be easy for you. I mean, this fire has been open here for the past two hours. And you are not doing anything. Eh? It's obvious you can't get over this until you fix it. Well, that's the point. Emeka, how do I fix things? When she accused me of having an affair with the mother. Jesus Christ! Why would she conceive such thought in her head? No, 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 no. I disagree with you. Okay, so an insect flew into her mother's eyes. I tried to help her. Suddenly, Angulika walks in saw us in a compromising position she began to scream hey. calling on the neighbors telling them that i'm having something sexual to do with the mother jesus christ this is serious <sighs> listen if i divorce her right now people would call me a bad person and they would say I i'm not good enough to keep a woman or to keep a wife see don't make your decision based on what people will say. You need to put yourself together first before making any decision. Hmm? We need a lasting solution to this problem. Now, I mean now. America, at this point, I don't care about making any decisions. I just want to focus on my life and what comes after. This time. Huh? See, bro, I, I just don't know what to do. This past few days has, has not been easy for me. You see, Justin, your wife told me so many striking things about herself. Let me ask you, how much of your wife do you know? I mean, come on, we, 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 do, we do talk, but not always. Yeah. You see, after discussing with your wife, I realized something was lacking. Communication. Communication lacks in your marriage. And this is one very important, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, very important thing you need in your marriage. You know why? It bonds the two of you. It makes you understand each other very, very well. But in your own case, it is lacking. I don't know if you get my point. Your wife is a rare gem, one of a kind. Please try and know your wife, bond with your wife. And you'll be happy you did. Ben, you're my friend. I have to tell you the truth. You see, my wife carries me. I mean, adores me like a king. So the fact that she doesn't monitor my movement and makes me just, you know, gives me that freedom to live life the way I want is beginning to hurt me. It's beginning to hurt me. That no matter what I do, she doesn't even feel it at all. You know when a man hurts a when a man hurts a woman and 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 you you know how how how, how bad you feel. So the fact that I don't get those feelings is beginning to torment me. That 
don't know how to fix this. I want a way to fix this with my wife. You see, let me shock you. Uju, Uju is not angry. She's not even worried. Really? You wouldn't believe it. She is not. You see, that's, that's my fear. You see, Justin. It's it's not her fault. Uh, but it is it is it is it is expected anyway. Ordinarily when a man offends the wife, especially when you cheat on her, there is this reaction you expect to get. Find out her do's and her don'ts. Spend time with your wife. She's a real gem. You see that woman? Yeah, naturally it is expected that when, when a man, a man cheats on his wife, she will react. It's, it, 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 it's a natural thing. But in your own case, it doesn't happen. That's she's that. too max in. When you're expecting her to react, she's just, she's, she's just there. Man, man, the woman has seen a lot. So that has built her mind. That is why she doesn't bother you when you do all these things. However, you shouldn't be taken for granted. You get Settle with your wife. Communicate with your wife. Bond more with her. Bond more. Take her out. Gist her. You enjoy that woman. See with you. You enjoy her. Apologizing to me, and you're angry with me. What? Yes. Apologize to you for what? Huh? Listen, please. Don't put words into my mouth. All right? Live your life the way you want it, and leave me the hell alone. I beg you. Wait, wait, wait a minute. I just, I, I want to know. Have you seen another woman? Oh, yes, I am. I thought you knew. As I'm speaking, why? Am I not good enough for you? Why are you doing this? Only, I had a very long day at work today. Okay? I came back home so I can rest. So just leave me alone. Babe. I am. Um, I, I know I must have acted bad in recent times, but that's not the way to correct me. What about the love we share? Have you suddenly forgotten that? The love we used to share, right? The love we used to share. Listen. It's obvious we're not in love with each other anymore. Okay? Because I can't remember the last time we talked about love. It's all in the past, yeah? I speak it, please. That is not enough reason to bring another woman into the house. Please. It's enough reason to bring another woman into the house. And for your information, the same attitude you're displaying right now is why I cheated on my ex. My first wife, yes. And I'm about to cheat on you too. If you keep doing this. Pasibiki, for goodness sake, how would you feel if I cheat on you? It's okay. I won't be surprised if you're cheating on me. I mean, I'm not God. Who knows if you're cheating on me right now? Listen, if we can't share healthy intimacy, then there's no point being together. Don't you think so? There's no point. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. 
that's exactly what is happening to me I am responsible for what is happening to me I was looking out for myself Try to please myself Now I realize that there's no gain In causing all this pain Oh, what a shame Chiu, I don't want to lose my home I don't want to my husband looked me in the face and told me that he could see another woman. What do I do? I don't, I don't want to lose my home. I told you, you need to adjust. Yes, in every home, one needs to adjust for things to work out. But you can only walk away when you feel you can no longer fit in. Chiwa, I just want my husband. I just want my home. <laughs> I can't do anything to keep that man. I, I, don't, I don't want to lose him. <sighs> Come on. Marriage is not a do or die affair. No. It's not a crime for you to walk away. <laughs> but if there is every possibility for you to stay back and adjust, then do it. Besides, there is no perfect home out there. Okay, I am. Um, I, I want to adjust. Yes. You do? I do. It's okay. Just go back home. Have a word with your husband. You both to have one-on-one. -on -one. Talk to each other. And do everything he wants you to do. Make sure you do everything. Ask him what he wants you to do for things to work out. Remember, you have to be flexible with your decision this time around. I beg you. Okay? Go home, Go home, Go home now, If my madam comes back and sees you here, hey! Oh, you're going to regret ever setting your foot in this place. Go! Oh. Please, whatever your name is, I am not here to see your madam. I need to see your girl, Mr. Zubike. Can I go in, please? Oh, one mom. You're here to see your girl. In Yanga, they sleep, trouble, they wake up. If you have any message for Oga, give it to me. I will take it straight to him. This is the one place to stay. You are talking rubbish. Excuse me. Hey, 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 hey! Allow me to... Hey, hey! Hi, Yes, some um, young lady, who are you? She said she wants to see your girl. Can you just keep your mouth shut, you oh, porcupine? I didn't ask you. Sorry, how may I help you, please? My name is Isabella. I'm here to see Mr. Hey, that had the reason. That had the reason. You just keep oh. shut. I just sick of something. Um, sorry. I'm his wife, so whatever message you have for him, you can give to me. I'll pass it on to him. That's very nice. Thank you. I am pregnant. Yes. <laughs> sorry, the last time I checked, my house is um, not a lab, neither is it a hospital, so what are you doing here? Okay, I am pregnant for him. <laughs> yes. For him. See what I've done to myself. 
Before you do anything in life. I don't understand. Did you have to come to this house? What kind of stupid question is that? Azubike, do you pick my calls? Do you respond to my messages to you? I call you, you don't pick. I send you messages, you do not reply. Oh, you want me to suffer this thing alone? No, it will not happen. We enjoyed it together and we are going to suffer together. Yes. Sweet. How could you? How could you do this to me? Where did I go wrong? What did I do to you? How could you do... What? What, what did you say? Are you out of your mind? It is your fault! You pushed me into doing this! And if you have nothing to say, just shut the hell up! What? Um, please, uh, you guys can fight when I'm gone. Not when I'm here, please. You can settle your family problems later. But you see me, I'm not leaving here. Just settle me and let me go! You're going to leave my house. I'm just sick of something. Can't you see that he is a married man? He didn't know he was married and he was sleeping with me. He didn't know. No, madam. You're a very heartless person. You see a pregnant woman like me and you're talking to me like this. I should go out and suffer alone. No, it will not happen. We are suffering. In fact, I don't even have time. You call me heartless in my You're heartless. Home. I am What is it? I am... Um, <clears throat> I just want to... I want to know what you want our home to be now. You don't expect me to answer that question, do you? I'm not in the mood. Please. I just want us to fix things. I just want us to make things right. I'm ready to be a changed person. I, I don't want us to keep fighting, please. Or are you, are you still planning on sending me away? Angli, I'm not sending you away. But you must understand that you're no longer that woman I fell in love with. I'm still that woman, I promise you. I, I just need you to give me the chance to prove myself to you. I'm still the same Aulika you met. Please. Please, babe, I'm begging you. Please. All right. First, I want my kids back. And when they come back, you must accept them as your children. Okay, it's fine. I promise to bring them back today. And I would never raise a hand on them. I would never even shout at them, please. Easier said than done. I promise I would not do it. I'm a changed person. Please. Secondly, I need you to employ someone to handle your business and you would visit your business premises once in a while. My love, you know my business is, the business is still growing. I can't afford to get an external staff now. It's, it's a small business. How do I pay the person? 
And I need to be there to oversee things as well. How much do you need to make that happen? Say, um, five million naira. Five million? If that's going to bring my wife back home, I'll give you five million. Thank you. Listen, Angoli. I have missed you so much. And I'll do anything it takes for you to come back home. Don't you understand? And I miss you too. So tell me, what do we do about the girl outside? Do you, um, do you want to marry her? Marry her? She's pregnant. How can I marry a girl? You know what? How can I marry a girl like that? Very well then. If that's the case, then I'll handle it. It's fine. How do you intend to handle it? Not to worry. I'll handle it. Excuse me. What you sow is what you reap That's exactly what is happening to me I am responsible for what is happening to me I, was I want us to talk myself. Woman to woman <laughs> Well, it depends on the kind of talk of course I don't know what I, don't know what I want to talk about mm. What do you want from us? What do I want? Madam, I am pregnant. If you want to take me to the hospital, it's not a problem. I am pregnant. I am not going to suffer this alone. It's not possible now. You're a woman. You understand this now. If I give you money, would you leave me and my family alone? I mean, um, it depends on the amount of gold. Two million naira. Are you doing it or not? So where's the money? When am I getting it? equivalent of two million naira. I want you to take this money and stay away from my family. I don't want to see you an inch close to my husband. If I smell you anywhere around here. I'll eat you alive. Don't touch my money. And you can keep it now. But make sure you beg him very so that he will not come and start begging me. Give it to him very well. Satisfy him. Good advice. Have it. Next week. Baba. Madam. Make sure I don't see this thing anywhere around my house. 
amount of money. Are you serious? I took it, but I don't think this is what I need. I don't understand. You mean you've been meeting people with your pregnancy? Lucy, I can't believe you could say this about me. Why? Anyways, Azubike's wife gave me this money. She gave me the money to pay me off. <laughs> to pay me off. Mm. Babe, in that case, your father must know about this. Okay. I mean, at this point, I think it's better you come straight and tell me to leave your house. I'll go. No, no, no that's not what I meant. Then why did you inform? I mean, why are you inform my father? You know, see, I told you something. My father does not like my life. I don't want him involved in my life, in anything that concerns me. This one clearly told me I can never amount to anything in my life. Yes, and he froze my account so I can live the life he wants me to live. Hell no! Are you bringing my father into this? You mean he said all this to you? In that case, this is the time for you to prove him wrong by living right. You're still smoking. Sorry. Azubika, what are you saying? You mean you had something to do with another woman? To make her honestly, I can't explain how it happened. But the same reason I was asking my wife to change. See, Azubike, you are not doing yourself any good. You are placing a negative tag on yourself. And you know, it's not telling good of you. Eh? My wife sorted out everything. Who is she? I mean, how did you get to meet her? Mecca, it's a long story. One of those days, my wife denied me of my conjugal rights. I was lonely. I, I went out. I had a lot to drink and couldn't remember what happened after that. Shall we? What is it? Sit down. Angolika, I can clearly see you're not ready to change. Do you know I've been home since 5 p.m.? Yeah. I've been home with the kids who've been waiting for you to return. I put them to sleep. You got back. And now, I feel like it is time for me to spend some time with my wife. And all you do is tell me, oh, honey, go to the dining and uh, I, have, I have things to do. Why are you like this? Mr. BK, what is it? Hmm? What is it? What will I do in this house that would just, that would just be okay with you? Why do you keep keep attacking me for every little thing. I do these things because of you. Why are you complaining? Listen are we going to go on like this for the rest of our lives? Yes. If you don't want this constant quarrel, then you have to listen to me. I, I know I'm a romantic guy, but that part of me is gone because you don't even give me attention. You don't spend time with me. Sometimes I feel like we should eat together, dine together. 
do things together. We, I mean, Azubike, Azubike, Biko, 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 yeah, Biko, you, 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 you are nagging too much these days. You're beginning to nag and it's really getting on my Is nerves. that what you're saying? Yes, that is what I'm saying. Funny enough, women crave for attention, but now I don't even understand. You're the one craving for attention. You're becoming a drama king. So that's what you're saying? That is exactly what I am saying. That I'm nagging too much. Azubike, your food is on the table. Please, go and eat. I still need to finish washing the dishes, taking care of the children's clothes, even your own clothes. Pico, let me be. Angoli, when the right time comes, what will happen? We shall see. As we keep Pico, come on, it's your Where's my khaki? Okay, it's your Ah, khaki. As we keep, where are you going at this time of the night? As we keep. Hello? Anyone here? Can I sit? Yes, you can. Alright, thank sit you. Um, you come here often? Um, not really. really. Just sometimes. My name is Azubike. Okay. Isabella is my name. Nice to meet you. Okay. Um, I'm here to have a few bottles, you know, okay. and also clear my head. I, I have a lot I need to get off my chest, you know. We need that sometimes. Yeah. You, you mind I call for a drink? Yeah, that's okay. I was, I was actually going to call out for, okay. you know, a bomb just... man, so. Waiter! Did anything happen? What have I done? <laughs> what have you done? <laughs> oh my god. I cannot believe I had the best sex in my life. God, you are good! <laughs> Listen, whatever happened between us was a mistake. No. Please, whatever happened was a mistake. That's your business. I'm a married man! I'm married! Okay. And I had fun. I had fun. In fact, we can have just one more time. You must be out of your mind. Come on, just one. Come on. Okay. Emeka, honestly, I can't remember how it all happened. You know me. If I was in my right senses, I won't touch another woman. Azubike, you mean you slept with another woman without using protection? Is that how careless you can be? I honestly... I, I didn't remember, you know, using... protecting myself. I was drunk. What if this woman in question has infected you with a virus? God forbid. I went to the hospital and I was clean. Let's just hope so. Listen, I haven't experienced this before, okay? And I, I apologize for my carelessness. However, I 
I'm yet to find out how she located me. Excuse me. Do you remember me? Please excuse me, I need to drive. So you don't remember me? I'm asking you, do you remember me? You're saying excuse me, I need to drive. I don't remember you. Okay, you can't remember me? No. Two weeks ago, you carried me, you picked me from the street and we went to the hotel. You can't remember me? You must be mad. Please get off. Oh, you want us to shout now? You want us to shout now? Ask me if I'm mad. You want us to shout now? I am not mad. I am not mad. Okay, okay. No problem. When you were having unprotected sex, I said, leave me alone. Leave me alone. He said, no. I said, stop, stop. He said, no, you want to come. You are finished coming inside me. You are telling me what? No. See, 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 see. Now you are telling me that you don't remember me. When I'm ready, you will know. I'll give you time to say it. Please. Okay. Wait till I reach. You know those people in this way. I think you're crazy. Okay. Okay, we will know it's crazy that time. Good day, sir. Good day. What can I do for you? Uh, I told you I'll be back. Here I am. Please, I asked you a question. What's, what can I do for you? Stop wasting my time. What can I do for you? Do you realize I can be a mad girl anytime? And if you want my madness, I can easily unleash it. Okay, I am pregnant. What do you want us to do about this? Listen and listen good. I can remember offering you a lot of money. Right? I know I paid you off. So what are you doing here? I'm here because I enjoyed every bit of it and I want more. Is that too much to ask? Listen, I'm going to call the security to throw you out. I will not stop you from calling the security either. I will not. Go ahead and call the security. Perhaps we could discuss this issue in front of your security. And if you want me to go, I will. But anywhere we see, we are going to talk about this. Excuse me. Have a nice day, sir. Emeka, I thought she was joking. And the next minute I saw her in my house. Huh? My goodness. This will really hurt your wife so bad. What are you going to do about it? My wife gave her some money and she left. I pray she never returns. Do you support her to abort your child? Well, I never said that, but are you saying I, I should get married to her? Well, I'm not saying you should get married to her, but for the sake of your child, you need to secure the life of that unborn child. You know, this is the second time this is happening to me. And sometimes I wonder if it's genetic or something is wrong with me. There is nothing genetic here. This is a case of carelessness from your end. You know, you always vent your frustration wrongly. And it ends up landing you in a big trouble. Huh? How do you undo this now? You know what? I just pray she never returns. That's all I have to say. So, what becomes of your child? Emeka, why are you interrogating me? Are you insinuating that I get married to her? Well, I never said so. Who's there? Come in, come in. Just come back home, please. 
I was scared. I don't I don't know how to how to face you. It's okay. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was looking out for myself, trying to please myself. Now I realize that there's no gain in causing all this pain. Come and bring me. Oh, what a shame. Oh. Won't you come and bring me? I've missed you so much. To blame because of my efforts. Now I feel, I feel so much pain. Oh, so much shame. Oh, oh, oh. Lay him there on Wemo. Lay him there on Wemo. My daughter, I do not want you to abort that child. Is that clear? It is a taboo where I come from. It's also against my beliefs as a court rationalist. Do you get that? I don't want to abort it. That's I want it. to keep the child. All right. But I hope that young man is still single. Um, um, I hope he's still single. He's married, Papa. He's married with kids. Married with kids? How can you sleep with a, a married man without protection? That is why I always have problems with you. You do dangerous things without thinking of the aftermath effect. Do you think I hate you? I don't. I mean... I love this man so much and I fell in love with him the very first time I met him. You are in love with him? That's to say you are ready to settle for a second wife. You want to be the second wife? Answer me. You want to be the second wife? Honey, you remember we need to visit Mama today. I didn't forget. <laughs> I remember. I was wondering. Do you think Oma and Obi would like to visit again? <sighs> I'm sure they will. I um. Um, I'll talk to them. I'm pretty sure they'll forgive me. What do you think? It's okay. Just be hopeful. Hey! Hello! Hey, okay. There is fire on the mountain. Oh, God, it will be annoying. I smell trouble. Some people are there. They want to see you. Who are they? But at this juncture, they came with bodyguards. Hey! Bodyguards, yo! Hey, hey, put your voice down. Is that why you're shouting? Oh, one of them. Uh -uh. Where are they? <laughs> down. Outside the gate. Outside the gate. Hey, bring your voice down. This is this is not on each other. I don't know why you keep shouting no. like a madman. Go, go and open the gate. Madam. You just said go open and get the gate. The gate. Hey, 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 hey. Get out! Hey, hey! Are you expecting anyone today? Um, not really. Uh, let's go. Let's find out. Okay. Uh, young man, you just have to take her in. Take good care of her until she's delivered of the baby. Take care of her. Take her into where? Oh, see, over my dead body will this thing come into my home. It will not happen. 
Not my house. It will not happen. Look, if you don't want it in a peaceful way, you better meet me out there in the court. What court? And I'll give you two ways to decide that. Hey, hey. I said we can. Wait You have seen it. I hope you're happy now. You heard what I said? Is it clear to you? It will not happen. I am. I want to understand what's going on. Are you telling me you are going to bring that lady into our home? What would you have me do? Fight the police? I was asked to take care of the pregnant girl and that's the right thing of to do. Of course you can take care of her, but you don't have to do that here. You cannot bring her into our home. Go out there, get an apartment for her, pay for it and foot her bills until she puts to bed. I tried to do that, but she refused and well, she said she wants to stay here. And you this... would have to refuse too. That is it. You would have to refuse too. You can't bring that woman into this house. No way. Then you're expecting me to fight the father. But no, I'm not winning. I'll lose the fight. Why are you so relaxed? Why are you so comfortable? Are you telling me you are going to take in that woman and her bastard? Is that what you're telling me? Hang on me. That child is not a bastard. I'm the father. <laughs> oh. Congratulations to the newest father in town. You were so comfortable telling me that you were going to take him, that woman and her bastard. That is not going to happen. That woman is not going to come into this house. It will not happen. I would rather die than let that woman come into my home, over my dead body, or I will go back to my father's house. You either choose me or her, because I would not have it. I won't take it. That woman won't come into my home. Jesus, do you know, do you know what? Don't to keep this home. Do you know how many times I have tried to keep this home? I have done everything to keep you, to keep my son, and keep everything. I, I wouldn't have it. I would not take it. That woman wouldn't come into this home. It would not happen. something better for you. I wanted you to go to the university, make good grades, secure a good job, and have great men gushing after you. It is unfortunate I cannot live the kind of life that you want me to live. Papa, in your word, you said I am the dumbest person in life, and you might be right. You just might be right. Papa, I am not good with education. I cannot live the life you want me to live. Can't you see? But even if you cannot live the life I want you to live, it still can be someone better. You can still choose a part in life mm. that everyone around you will be proud of. Papa, just leave me alone. Let me be. You seized every single thing that I have just to bend to your wish. Papa, since the day I left you, by now you should know I cannot even... I can't, I can't change. This is me. Okay. Let me start sorrying, Dad. I am your father. And nothing can change that. I've already denied you my support, but now I'll do that no more. Oh. As long as you do nothing illegal, you have my support. You have said that before, Papa, and nothing changed. People have always blamed me for being too harsh on you. I 
and giving you the fatherly roles I denied you. Yes. Henceforth, do with your life whatever you wish. But have it at the back of your mind that the life you're living is not what I planned for you. I wish you said this earlier. I'm sorry. It's coming too late, but I'll make it up. I'll make it up. I'll make it up, my daughter. Stop crying. Okay? I'm sorry, my daughter. Though it's coming too late, I'll make it up to you. And your father, I know the kind of person that I am. I'll make it up to you. Stop crying, my daughter. Please stop crying. Stop crying. We don't cry again. Hmm? I'll make it up to you. It is playing out, Chinwe. It is playing out before my very own eyes. Amelie, what happened? Put yourself together and speak to me. When my husband has finally done it, my worst fears has come to play. <laughs> my husband has impregnated another girl. What? Yeah. What? This is sickening. What is wrong with your husband? Why can't he hold himself? Three women in a row? No. No. Your husband is so irresponsible. I don't know what to do. Chiwe, I don't know what to do. With that girl's body language, if she moves into my home, I am finished. Chiwe, what do I do? Please, hold on. Hold yourself together. Oh. What is your husband saying about this? Mm -hmm. I mean, what is his reaction towards this? Mm -hmm. He wants to bring her into our home. My husband wants to bring that girl into our home. <sighs> Chinwe, it's all my fault. I just wish I could turn back the hands of time. My husband back. I want my home. I don't want to lose my husband. I don't want to lose him, Chiwe. I don't want to. It's okay. I don't even know what to say. I'm, I'm so speechless. <laughs> Please, just put yourselves together. I can't. Remember you have your children with you. Please, I beg you. Please. This is not happening. The man is ready to take me to court if I don't cooperate with his daughter. So what is the girl saying? What do they want you to do? They just want me to be around her. But the girl knows you are married. She's aware I'm married, but I feel like the devil is just trying to use her to destroy my family. You see, I've been telling you not to allow such a thing to happen. Eh? This is a very big problem that you just involved yourself now. I understand how you feel, but... I don't understand why a young vibrant, beautiful girl would, would would want to cause trouble in my family. You see, that shows how irresponsible she is. You don't need such a woman in your life. Huh? You always allow the problem of your family to make you make mistakes that will affect you. Huh? What are you going to do now? My mother said my father married six wives. I 
and I'm beginning to think something is wrong with me. If not, could this be a pattern in my family or a template I must follow? As we can see, let me tell you something. No woman is perfect. If care is not taken, you end up taking more wives, just like your father did. You just have to be careful. Babe, you still insist on going to live with that man? Do you have a problem with that? Oh, so you don't see any problem with it? Babes, you can't cease to amaze me. Like, what, what happened? Like, what did this man do to you that you just took the decision of going to live with him like a married man? Hey, hey, hey. listen. You really want to know what this man did to me? I've told you this thing before. Hey, hey. In bed. Ah. Only that man they thought that sport. Who be the man? Eh? They never born anybody. My sister, if this guy handle you, leave. Forget it. Ah, no, 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 no. We hey. even go there. See the advice. It's not even important. Game. I mean, you're just so funny. Like, you mean the criteria to getting an ideal man is someone who is good in bed? Babe, are you, are you even listening to yourself? What, what is wrong with you? Are you okay? Lucy, can we just end this conversation now? Please, can we? Can we? Please. You are different from me. I am different from you. We have different orientations. Can you respect my wish so I respect yours? Please. What useless wish? Please, leave that married man alone. <laughs> leave him alone. Mm. Well, I blame him for, for being promiscuous, but... I can't support you to go live with a married man and then put problem in his family. Which, which, which family? Which family? Who cares about the family? My sister, what I care about right now is my happiness and that's all that matters to me. Anyways, I, I, he should be outside now waiting for me, so let me just go and see him. Anyway, no need to escort him, just let me go on my own. I've been waiting for you. Do you realize you've been keeping me waiting? Hold it right there. Just hold it. Why are you shouting? Why? If you're ready to take me, please let's go. No, I'm not ready to take you. I've been here waiting for you. So? Is that why you're shouting? Please get in, let's go. No, 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 no. Hold it. You're not ready for me. You're, see, you're not even ready for me now. I don't like this thing. Babe, please, you have to calm down. You don't have to start now, please. Please get please. inside, let's go. If he wants it down. hot, I will give him hot. And if he wants it cold, I will give him cold. Get in. Calm See him shouting. My kids like that. How am I supposed to know those dirty pigs were your kids? Did you say they almost stand me? Do you want to get a dirty slap from me? This she needs a slap from you. This idiot needs a slap from you. Wait, my own children, the children I carried in my wombs, those are the ones you're calling pig. I did not. Pig. It is you and your generation that are pigs. Are you, you your grandmother, your grandfather, everybody in your family. Are you be care? What is girl? What who? What is your wife for? What now? What now? can take anything from you, but you see calling my children names. Ha <laughs> <laughs> My dear, I will not take it. I will not take it from anyone. You will not try it. You see what you've got. You will not try what? See, because you see where your madness started. That's where my own will stop. Uh, Have you heard me? Where your own started is where my own will stop. My sister. Don't try me. Yeah, my madness. Mm -hmm. Listen, I can take anything from you, but you see calling my children names. Mm -hmm. Ah, my dear, I will not take it. 
I will not take it back. You will see the other side of me if you try. It. And your other side of me, when your other side sees the other side of me, your other side will walk. I you my other side. Fear my other side. Yeah, my other side. Fear my other side. Because too. my other side will not survive. So what will you? happen? Your ginger, hey. your kidney, everything will not survive. It. What will now? Asubike, I quit where? You should come and say something, Asubike. Talk, Asubike. Say something. You brought say something. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you going? I said talk to her. What happened? Jessica, sister just called me. She said her husband has brought in another woman into the house. Eh? Would he have brought in another man? Eh, eh, eh. Jessica, let today be the first and the last you will tell me anything about that your sister called Amureka. Taburi is in Ikpazo. In Anuya. Mama, she said they, 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 they are fighting. I even heard the woman's voice in the background. She said the woman has been fighting her ever since she got into that house. Oh. Yes. Um, Jessica, please, go inside and prepare my food for me. Biko. Go and get me food. Mama, I still think that we should find a way to help sister. Mama, I'm talking to you. Okay, you are right. We should find a way to help her. At least you for fight for her. Why do you come and tell me? You're supposed to go and fight for her now. Get inside, go and get me my food. Oh, see, so I should be back with Get! What are you standing for? What is she looking for? Hey, who? Hey, get back, get back, get back, get back, Mama, hey, get back, get back. I hear background. I hear. Hey, you for here up ground. Not only background. Now up ground, you will hear this time. Hey, are you, baby? Asubi, you know I don't like trouble. You know I'm a very sober person. Mm -hmm. I don't like issues. All I am asking is that you take this woman, take her out of my house, rent somewhere else for her to stay. That is all I am asking. Biko! Uh, Madam, I'm ready to go if you want me to go, as long as he's coming with me. Or is he coming with I you to get? Coming, commando. Coming where? Where is he coming to? My husband is going nowhere with you. My husband will not step out of this house with you. Trust me, you don't want to do this. I don't want to do what? You really do not want to go down this route with me. Look at Nonya. Look at Nonya. You will just die for nothing. My sister, you will just die for nothing. You will die like a, I will give you rat poison. You will die like a rat, I'm telling you. You will get ready to die first. Moa, you will die first. Me? Yes. Azubike. Azubike, tell this woman to leave my home in peace. That is all I'm asking. Look at this shameless thing. Mm. Look at this, this, this nonentity. You want to use your father's influence to come and occupy another woman's house. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Okay, now I can allow you to insult anybody. In fact, I do not like my father. Everybody knows that, but you will not insult my father. See, I will insult you. I will insult your father. Forgive that to a stupid child like you. You insult my father. Because you don't have sex. Azubike, you don't have sex. Advise your wife. Azubike, advise your wife. She will not like me. Hey. She will not like me. Oh. Sister, I don't like you. It's no, not I don't talk. Like you. I don't. Like I don't you. talk. I am Leave my husband's house. That is all I am asking. Baby, come closer, please. Which baby? I need to tell you something. No. See, 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 see. Oh my mind, the get man. Baby, come closer. There's something. Come story. closer to me, please. Come close. See, please. You this animal. Oh. Don't let me. Don't. don't, don't what will you do? You what will you do? You're asking me. No, what will you do? Oh, my if you doesn't want me, why oh, do you want me? Why did you bring me here? 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 You must give me attention. I want to push her. You should not give me anything. You say you will not give me. He will not even try it. No. I will leave him alone. Don't try it. Don't try it. Stand up. Like they say. How you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. Hey, hey! What? What are you doing? 
What are you doing here? What does it look like I'm doing here? What am I doing here? What might I be doing in the bedroom? Listen, listen to me. I, I don't have time for this foolishness. Go straight to the visitor's room. So who is a visitor here? Me. I'm a visitor. A visitor in, in your house. I have your baby in here. I am no longer a visitor. Ah. I just, I beg. Uh, hey! Sir, uh, what? What's going on here? You're this little nitwit. <laughs> Who opened the door for you? Oh! So you brought your shameless self to my bedroom to seduce my husband. Seduce who? Seduce someone that has me. Madame, my bed, just tell her to go. It is my turn. Hey, come hey, on, hey, come hey, on, hey, hey, don't I'm touch talking, me. you're climbing the bed. Are you mad? No! Are you mad? Okay, okay you want to fight? No, no, come, come. Hey. I don't know, but I believe I can handle things. Oh, fine, Dad. Hmm? Okay, Dad. Dad, mm -hmm. please send this woman away. Please. I send her away? Yes. Oh, yeah, Dad. Look, we don't even know her. Please, we don't want her to, you know, hurt our mom. Please. Just it's okay. Move. I promise you I'll fix things. All right. Thanks. Okay. You will fix things? Yeah, I will. You will fix things. Okay. Promise me whenever you hear them scream at each other, go to your rooms and shut the door. Why? Because it's wrong for kids to watch people fight. Why? Because there's no answer to that. Why? It's time to go to bed. No more whys, okay? Alright. No more Dad. questions. Alright, let's go. All right, let's go we'll say our prayers. You fix things? Hey, we'll say our prayers and we'll go to bed. Okay? Oh, Get up. Man. Are you okay? Okay. Bro. Can we pray here? No. So we... We'll go to your room and pray. Oh right. I mean... Let's go. Hmm. Kevin, don't be stubborn. I'm only calm down. Please just calm down. As I'm speaking to you now, I'm even on the road. Yes, just calm down. This is serious. Eh? So that girl is not ashamed of herself. She should be ashamed of herself. Oh, okay, calm down. So what is your husband doing about this? What is he doing about this? What? Just calm down. I don't want you to do something to hurt yourself. Remember your children. Remember. Can you hear me? Just listen to me. Yes. I feel there's a time for you to speak to someone from his family. I mean, your mother-in-law or your sister-in-laws. What? Anguli. Anguli. Can you see yourself? Take a look at it. You're not even in good terms with your mother-in-law. No now. All the wrong, all the very bad. Eh? Okay, so, so what are we going to do now? This is more reason you should be in good terms with your mother-in-law or someone from your husband's family. Yes. So they can always speak on your behalf. Because this matter is no longer getting, you know, it's not a small case. 
just calm down. Calm down. I will try to see you. I will think of something. I'm on the road. Yes. Please just put yourself together. I don't want you to, to start feeling bad. I'm here for you, Biko. Don't worry, I will call you. Let me think of something. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I am responsible for what is happening to me. I was looking out for myself, trying to please myself. Now I realize that there's no gain in causing others pain. Oh, what a shame. Oh, now I have myself to blame because all my efforts have been in vain. Now I feel, I feel so much pain. Oh, so much shame. Oh, lay him there on Wemo. Lay him there on Wemo. See what I've done to myself. Lay him there on Wemo. I'm not surprised. I know you won't come to see me except you have a problem. <sighs> I'm sorry about that, Mama. I know I have not been a good daughter, you know. But Mama, please, I am I'm ready to make amends. Please. Mm. It's bad to wake up when it's too late to go to the market and too sunny to go to the farm. I wish you understood what it meant when the cock crows. I need you to help me. I don't want to lose my husband. He is, he is everything I have, Mama. He's the only thing I have got. I don't want to lose him. Even before you get married to any man, there's need to make the members of his family your friend. If the man you just saw and got married to had people he had been living with since his birth. And these are the people that we show you the roadmap to his heart. You go to the market and you buy some goods that have manuals. That's how your husband's relatives are his manual for you. He has children. You abandoned everybody because you were not wise. Even his own children. <laughs> Mama, that is why I'm here. I can't have him bring in another woman to the house. Mama, I don't want it. I can't share my home with another woman. Not, not with that woman, please. Are you for real? <laughs> Hi. I can't ask my son to send her away with my grandchild. My son told me that the girl wants to stay. Besides, his father married six wives. Yes, six. Mama, hmm? this is not fair. <laughs> that is not enough reason for him to bring in another woman into our home. <laughs> I, 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 don't, I don't want it, Mama. Be quiet. I, I don't want it. Mm -mm. That was how you replaced his first wife. You should know that karma will always come back. <sighs> yes, karma does come round. So if you want to fix things, you have to start from the root. You have to start from the root. You know what? 
My only pain is that my son keep repeating the same mistake his father made. Touch a woman once, she gets pregnant. And the next minute she's madly in love with you. Is this a spell? Honestly, I have wondered. And I'm still wondering. Hi. <sighs> What is that evil woman doing here? She has succeeded in chasing us out from her father's house. She better stay and never come here to bother us. If that woman knows how much I hate her, she never ever in her life take off come here. Her wickedness is second to none. I just want to apologize for everything I did to you too. I'm sorry. I don't even know what came over me. Please, I'm begging you to. I, I don't know what came over me. I'm really sorry. Please, 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 please stay away from us. We don't want you. Just stay away from us. That's all. Stay away from us. Obi, we don't oh, want you. Please, I I'm begging you to. I'm really sorry. I'm a changed person now. Please. Obi, don't touch me now. Don't, don't touch me. Oma, please. Oma, Oma. Oma, Oma, please. to a lot of money. Hey! Mm -hmm. So Please, I'm so happy for you. Now I am a mean low man. Uh, you can say I've <laughs> always known that you'd be oh a millionaire. My God. In fact, you've always been a millionaire. It didn't get there. So it didn't so end happy. there. He said, if you need anything, just let me know. I'll give you the money. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. I mean, that's how it's supposed to be. Oh. I mean, you can't be living like a poor girl when your father is very rich. I know, but... Is it my fault? It's not my fault. Sometimes you don't scold a child like that. Yes, I have realized I messed up at some point. Some point. Mm -hmm. But we spoke. We spoke. We Has really... your father not been talking to you? Uh -uh. He has been talking to me, but babe, there's a way you talk to a child. Seriously. You go talk to him. Yeah. You understand? Shut, 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 shut. You go talk to people get sense. You don't understand? Uh -uh, see that baby. You know what? I can't wait to hear everything. I want to hear everything you he guys told about. He told me a lot. A Let's lot. Go inside, no problem. <laughs> I, I'm not going out again. No? You are going out. Oh, I oh, What goes around always comes around. Oh, 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 oh. What you mean, me? Oh, the world is a mystery. So think twice. What are you doing here? What are you doing here? Mama, Biko, Biko, I am sorry. I'm sorry for what? I'm sorry, I'm in so much trouble right now, Mama. I will not allow you to enter this house until you tell the women of this family. You tell the women of this family how you cut me and your husband. Hey, Mama, I, I, Leave my house. So I didn't say that. Hey! So, wait, I am now a liar. No, Mama, Mama, you are not. Why are you Mama, 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 
easy. I swear to you, I didn't tell a lot of people. It was just a close friend of mine I told. Please, just one person. A friend of yours? You told a close friend of yours. That close friend of yours will still tell another person. Another person will tell another person. Another person will tell another person. Another person will tell another person. Will tell another person. They will keep on spreading it. Uh, I don't even know what the problem is. I don't know what is wrong with me. I think I have a spiritual problem. I don't know what it is. Hey! You! Spiritual problem. You don't have any spiritual problem. You did this to your younger sister. You did it to me, your mother. Mba! This time, you have taken more than required. Hey! You will tell the elders of this community what you did. And the name of the spirit that is disturbing you. Um, isn't it? She says she is sorry. Please calm down. Nay, huh? calm down. Calm down, you say. Nay, <laughs> don't even go there. This is what she's been doing. She will tell the others of this family what happened. And after that, she will go to my father's compound and tell them what she did to me. She wants to rub shame on my face. Let's do it and see what comes out of it. In Anoya, because you should look up. Shut up your mouth. Mama, I see what you are doing. You accuse good people that comes around you. Papa, be cool. 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 I don't know what came over me. Papa, I'm losing everything, including my home. My husband is on the verge of getting married to another woman. Papa. Wait, 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 wait. Has it gotten to that? Papa, the woman he got pregnant now lives with us in the same house. My own house, Papa, under the same roof. Ah. My dear. This has gone beyond carefulness. Why? Huh? Uh, okay, what did he tell you? I mean, why would he do a, a thing like that? Why, it's all my fault. It's all my fault. I thought I had my husband to myself all alone. He always talks about regretting getting married to a second wife. So I thought we, we would stick together forever. Papa Biko. I still love my husband. I don't want to lose him. I don't want to lose him. I will talk to your mother. I will talk to her. We have to do something very, very fast. Just calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. Calm down. I say calm down. Everything will be fine. Calm down. Babe, I'm happy you are thinking this way. At least you finally stopped jumping from one man to another. Well, my sister, I'm happy for myself. But the thing is, I, I really love this guy. I just wish I could marry him. Really. Wait, you're still bent on forcing yourself on that man? I am not forcing myself. I've known this man for a very long time now, before we even started dating. And I deliberately kept that pregnancy and... I love him. I love him so, so much. But babe, you know he is married. I mean, how can you be killing yourself over a married man where there are single men ready to have you as their wife? Now, this was the reason I had problems with my father. He likes, you know, advising me in a way I do not even understand. He wants to bend me to his own way. And that's not my way of life. I like doing things at my own pace, my time. and. Girl, you know me. Well, you have your life to live. But if you must take my advice, I will advise you should leave that man. Yes. Even if you don't want the child, you can leave the child with the man after birth and then do something meaningful with your life. See, you still don't get the point. I am not with him because I am pregnant. I am with him because I love him. I truly love him. Babe, love from my heart. I'm not faking this. I am really in love with him. And this pregnancy is a deliberate one to hold us together. And I believe in the next, say, two, three months, I should be able to let him know that this is not 
like something to tie him, but I really and I truly love him. Well, okay. I, I hope you, you give him my own part of the money. Oh, like, please. I want to partake <laughs> from the millions. <laughs> Oh, you see? Uh, no, no, that's the very, the most important one. Oh, I don't even want to joke with that one. Please. Always remember what goes around, always comes around. Oh, 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 oh. What you mean, me? Oh, the world is a mystery, something to our eyes. Che, 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 che. Don't forget that what you do today will come back to you someday, someday. Don't forget that what you do today, you will pay for it someday, someday. Lay a lay a See what I've done to myself. See what I've done to myself Laying in the room Go to your room Hurry, hurry, go to your room Run, run Go to your room Isabella, what is the meaning of this? Why is it that whenever you come back home, you always frown your face? At what point are you supposed to get used to the fact that I live here now? What point? Listen to me, I don't have a problem with you being in this house, but I have a problem with you smoking in front of my kids. For goodness sake, will I be the first person to... Why are you acting like this? Oh, so... I am now spoiling your children. That's what you're saying. Sweetheart, I am not the first person they will ever see smoking and I will not be the last. Now listen and listen good. Isabella, I clearly understand that you're here to destroy my family, but I won't let you do that. Stop pushing me. Stop pushing me. Else, I'll leave this house for you. And listen to me, in this house I have laws. You must abide to them. But if you can't, then get out! Always remember what goes around Always comes around Oh, 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 oh What do you mean me? Oh, the world is a mystery Something to our eyes Che, 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 che Don't forget that what you do today will come back to you someday. What are you doing here? Please, I don't need you in this room. Go back to where you're coming from. Asubike, please. Can you stop sending me away? Please. You cannot doubt my love. I truly love you. I, I, I truly love you. Tr what? You said what? Are you out of your mind? You love who? I am a married man. Even if I wasn't, I can't be with you. I can't be with a prostitute like you. That's okay. I promise to change. I am willing to change. And you can change me. I can't... What? Listen, what do I tell my wife? What do you want me to tell my wife? I don't need a second wife. Okay? You can't even be my girlfriend. But I am carrying your child. This is a mistake. Make the mistake again. No! Listen to me! It was a mistake! I was wrong! Drink again, Asubiki! You must be out of your mind! Listen, you, you're, you're, you're so dirty, I can't even look at you. What the hell am I doing with you? Leave my room. Asubiki, please. I said leave! You know what? I'll just leave for you. Asubiki. As 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 Nine. Oh. You see this very thing that she did to me, even though she is my daughter. 
First thing tomorrow morning, I am going to report her to the elders and the old mother of this family. You know I don't support her. Yes, but reporting her to the people will cause more problem to this family. Hmm? Nine. She did not thought of that when she did what she did to me. Now you are begging me to forgive her. Yes, so you have to forgive her because she's your daughter. Huh? Like I said, reporting her to the people is like you washing our dirty linen outside. Secondly, she's about to lose her home. So it's supposed to be a sleepless night to us. Huh? We have to show her love. But have you called her husband to find out? Have you done that? Yes, I did. But he said that uh, the girl will stay with them until she give birth. Ha! Huh, I said it. I said it. What made Aurika to leave her husband and spend a night here? Hmm. Must be a serious case. See, since she came to this place, she has never been herself. Yes, it is obvious that she is going through serious depression. I think that is enough punishment. So adding another punishment might even lead her to, to harm herself. Can I show quite a love? Yes. I have lost everything. I have lost everyone I love. <laughs> I don't want to lose you. I'm sorry. Miku. <laughs> you will not lose me. You will not. I want you to change this your lifestyle. But you didn't listen to me. Now look at where it landed you. Please, it's okay, I've forgiven you. I've forgiven you, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, stand up, stand up, stand up. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I love you. I love you. I love you so much. It's okay. It's okay. Stop, stop, stop. Stop crying. It's okay. I've forgiven you. You are my daughter. Oh, my mom. It's okay. Oh, my mom. Baby, you're still here. Let's go to bed. What did you say? I said, let's go to bed. Don't say that to me again. <sighs> Listen. Listen, I know you're here to destroy my family. Okay? But I know what to do. How can you say this? I will forgive you because I truly love you. Babe, you know I love you. Stop saying this thing you say. Stop that. I'm very sure that thing you're carrying is not my child. Asubike, why are you doing this to me? Why? Asubike, please, I'm begging you. I'm so horny. I don't know. I don't know how to survive. Please don't touch me now. Don't touch me. You can talk without touching me. Okay. Let's just have this. What? What did you say? You must be out of your mind. Listen, I don't sleep with drug addicts. Okay? I don't do that. I'm sorry. Okay, just touch me, just a little. Just touch me, please. I don't know so very. Hey, hey, listen, go go back to the hotel where you belong. 
Those brothels, go back there. It's okay. Alpha. Azubike, what are you doing to yourself? Can't you see that life is going out of you? Emeka, what I'm going through right now is enough to take my life. What are you saying? Eh? You are gradually becoming different from the man I used to know. For days now you have been coming to work, but you have not been doing anything. I'm sorry, Mecca. I can't seem to get hold of my emotions. As we can see, you are sitting on a company worth millions. You just have to heal yourself before you land us into trouble. I'm trying, Mecca. But I can't seem to understand why these things are happening to me. This is how I lost my first wife, Uju. This girl is making life unbearable for me. See, Azubitwe, this is reality. You have made the mistake. All you need to do is to move on and learn from it. Just hmm? move on. Some time ago, you knew you were saying something about one lady. I can't remember something about herbs that she can help me in, in, like in the process of stopping smoking addiction and all of that. You mean a boga process? Uh -huh. You said something like that. So it can help me stop smoking. I need to quit smoking. Wait, are you serious? Stop now. Yes. <laughs> I mean, it's just for me to get the right address and contact necessary. Okay, send it for me. That's why I came. Hey, God has finally answered my prayer. Like, you don't understand how happy I am. Before you start prayer section now, can you just send it? I will. I send. Mm. Like, you <laughs> stop God. smoking for real. I'm stopping. Hey. I'm stopping. I'm sending you the number Please. right away. Please. Like they say, how you make your bed is how you lie on it. What you sow is what you reap. That's exactly what is happening to me. I'll be traveling. I'll stay away for like, say, two, three days. I'll call you. You can stay away forever. I really don't care anymore. Okay, I'll let you know when I arrive still. Oh, what a shame. Oh, now I have myself to blame because all my efforts have been in vain. Now I feel I feel um, so I've spoken much. to your husband, but uh, he is not sounding convincing. Uh, you, what do you want? I can't live in that house with that woman. I can't share the same roof with her. If she's not going to leave, then I'll just go there, pack my things and leave. Good. I don't think you should live with that girl. Yes, because some girls can do unbelievable things. I don't want anything to happen to my grandchildren or you either. It's exactly the same thing I'm saying. I'm scared. I, I, I need to take my children out of that place. I don't want anything to happen to me or my kids. Uh, but I don't want you to make a move. 
until we have a meeting with him. And you can go home and meet your kids. Huh? But I don't want you to leave that place at all. Leaving that place is dangerous. Up and down here. Lucy, thank you so much. You know, this um, Iboga thing, it really, really worked. It's okay. You're welcome. Thanks. You know, when I read about people talking about the efficacy of the medicine, I knew it's something you should try out. <laughs> so I'm happy. My sister, it worked though. I mean, I wouldn't have done all this without you. Thank you so much. I appreciate it totally. You're welcome. I mean, enough of the things. So, tell me, what do you want to do now? Do you still want to go back to that house? Uh, yeah, but I'll still try to let him know that I really love him. But if that doesn't work, then I have no option than to leave. You really do still love this man? <sighs> Lucy, let's not go back there. Let's not talk about this again. You already know. I love him and I still love him. Yes. Okay, enough of all this. Mm -hmm. So tell me, what business would you like to invest your money on? Uh, what I know how to do before my father died. I have to go back to it. You mean yes? Of course, yes. I'll be cool. I'll be having, I'll be getting food. You know, good. A lot of supply. Lie. 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 Yeah, not at all. Hey. I'm finished. You just signed away 250 million. Do you know what that means? You have just ended our company. 250 million. Hey. What have I done? What was I thinking? I trusted the guy. Azubike, do you know your problem? You were not focusing. Your focus and your emotion were divided. Eh? You were not concentrating. Now you have used your family problem to destroy the business that we have been building for long. Uh, I'm just tired. I don't know how I made this mistake. I... Uh, Emeka, can we do something? Anything at all? Let's do something. What are we going to do? You are the CEO of the company. Eh? I try my best to caution you. Now you have ended our struggle by yourself. I've been talking to you since all this while. Eh? Look at it now. Eh? Where are we going to start from? Where do we start from now? Two hundred and fifty million. It's okay. It's enough. It's enough. Don't tell me it's enough. We are talking about money here. This is two hundred and fifty million. We are talking about. Eh? We just you just folded our company. Where, where are we going to start from? Everything I have labored for gone down the drain in a twinkle of an eye. How? I said it. I said it. How do you have angels and devil under the same roof? It doesn't work. Since this witch came into this house, it's been from top to bottom. Everything has been declining. How do you keep this kind of, this, this NY in our own home? And you expect everything to go fine. But it will not happen. Madam, nobody is apportioning blame on anybody here. We are not here to accuse anybody. This discussion now is for solution. Ah, sorry, sorry, sorry. What solution? Oh, so you know what solution is? 
Yet you left your very perfect life. Came into my home. Balanced here and now you are giving me, tell, tell, telling me about solution. God punish you there. Azubike, if you know you want to have a proper discussion, I mean, let's look for a solution to this problem of yours. Come upstairs, meet me in the room and then we will talk. I have an idea that can help your company. That is if you're going to listen to me. Help my company? Yes. I don't mind anything to help me bounce back. Okay. Um, I'm going to discuss with my other brother and my uncle. Um, if they could partner with you in your business. You're going to do that? Yes. Wow. Can you do that? I can. On only one condition. Which is? Yes, Azubike, we have our differences. Can we keep that aside and face business? Can I trust you? Of course you can trust me. I've been a businessman and I take business very seriously. Okay, promise me you're going to be transparent to me. You're going to be very transparent in this business and to my family. <sighs> Listen, like I said, I've been a businessman for a while. And I promise you, I'll be transparent and I'll do anything you want me to do. That's fine. I mean, it's obvious I'm no longer needed in this house. I mean, I'm not welcome. By this time next week, I should be... I should be leaving. Who, who says you're not welcome? Says who? Listen, this house belongs to you. You need to feel at home. Besides, you're carrying my child. Okay? Are you sure? Of course! I am! <clears throat> so, Azumike, has the criminal been found? No, not yet. Emeka, I suspect that guy is diabolic. And I don't think anyone can catch him. But you sounded so excited as if the money had been returned. <laughs> well, that's because I have good news for you. So what is the good news? So Isabella introduced me to a big, wealthy businessman. And um, after a very long meeting, um, he promised to, to do business with me. Wow, yes. this is great. She also introduced me to a very big firm. Yes, and the, that firm promised to give me a loan. Imagine the Isabella we are calling a demon. It's now a messiah. <laughs> you know, I... I spoke to... Amonika about my predicament and I expected her to contribute positively but she had nothing to say what do you want her to do? you know she's not as rich as Isabella money is not everything I actually expected her to contribute verbally or you know advise me positively just say something that can encourage me, but nothing. Well, let's forget about um, Amulika for now. Let's talk about our company. 
Where are we going to start from? Give me a second. Hello? Is it ready? Okay. Man, this is a good news though. It is a very good news. Hey! Now this is the production point. Mm -hmm. If you look at the left hand side, mm -hmm. this is the distribution point. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So now you really need to concentrate on this distribution point so we can get more products. Awesome. I thought I knew this, but apparently you have to learn. But you understand what I'm saying? No, I do, I do understand. See what I've done to myself. Before you do anything in life Construction, distribution And this whole area now to yeah. get the products Especially Beautiful Someone <laughs> will get hurt <laughs> Think twice Forget it looks like this Right yes. Oh, think twice Amazing Always remember Since she helped him revive his business He has totally turned his attention to her This is really painful, you know. Very, very painful. But it's a shame. It's a shame that a beautiful and a wealthy girl like her would prefer to settle for a third wife. Hmm. Some girls are desperate, Sha. At this point, I just have to accept reality. My home is gone. My fears has finally happened. Angoli, you know if you ask me, I will say this is karma. Yes, now you know exactly how it feels to snatch another woman's husband. You can see it. I think I owe you an apology. Yes, you do. Now I understand what I made that woman go through. I need to apologize to her. Yes, you need to ask her for forgiveness. Let her forgive you. I'm very, very sure she might have said something. Yes, karma never forgets. Isabella, you brought me so much joy in a short period of time to my life. Made me richer in a short period of time. Sometimes I ask myself, what do you really want from me? You. I don't need anything from you. Azubike, all I want is you. I truly love you, for real, I do. Angulika is my second wife. I already know that. Your first wife remarried and she left the kids with your mother in the village. Azubike, I do not mind being your third wife. Honestly, I, 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 I don't know why this is happening, but it's happening. I don't mind if you bring your kids. They can come and stay here with me. I love children, you know that. I promise you, I will take care of your kids the way I will treat mine. You already know that. Yes. Isabella, the question is, with your influence, why pick me? Why pick me? I don't even know myself. Like, after the night we met, I just became so obsessed with you. I, 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 I can't place my hands on anything. I can't, I can't even figure out anything. All I know is, I love you. I love you too. The feelings are mutual.
What are you doing here? Please. I have come to apologize to you. I was very young and naive. I didn't even know I was living on the first lane. I just want to change my route. Whatever it is you want to do to me. Beat me, hit me, flog me, do whatever it is. I just want you to find a place in your heart to forgive me, please. <laughs> Honestly, as you do. I don't know what you're doing here because I hold nothing against you. Nothing at all. Would you, would you, please. Same way as took you home, another woman has taken over. Are you serious? So, what happened? He got another woman pregnant and brought her into our home. Oh my goodness. <sighs> That's really sad. It's okay, it's okay. I'm just asking for forgiveness, okay. please. No, please. please. Get up, it's okay. Yes. You see, when I ask questions about his family, and I heard that they always marry more than one wife, so that was enough courage I needed to move on. Thank you very much. It's okay, it's fine. I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Please stop, it's, it's okay, it's okay. You yes. actually made me a better person, you know that. <laughs> It's, so okay. it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Especially okay. okay. someone will get hurt. Think twice. Oh, think twice. Always remember what goes around. Always comes around. Where are you going? You going somewhere? I'm leaving. How could you treat me this way? What wrong did I do to you? And I'm still wondering how it took me this long to, to realize the kind of human being you are. You're so happy with me being here, sad like this. I need to find peace. You pushed me. And I want to believe you're happy. That's the reason I want to leave. So where are you going? Where are you leaving to? Somewhere not too far. This kids will attend the same school. I found a house close to my shop. Are you still my wife? children. 
For what is happening to me I was looking out for myself Try to please myself Now I realize That there's no gain In causing all this pain Oh, what a shame Oh, now I have myself to blame Because all my efforts have been in vain Now I feel, I feel so much pain Oh, so much shame Oh, oh, oh Before you do anything in life, cheer, cheer, cheer.